<clears throat> Excuse me. Hello, chat. It is time to play Gravity Rush. As it was foretold in the voting game. Why so much hype for 13 Sentinels? Because I, through my streamer, streamer weeb sense, I am aware of what games are highly anticipated you sound so weird do i does, does my mind microphone sound different and i know that 13 sentinels is one of the three heavy heavy hitters that we have on um on the list you sound very different do i really i just recorded it and it sounded fine hmm hold on you know what i bet it is Bet you it's picking up the second microphone. That's unplugged at this point, but it's probably still picking it up. No, it's not. It's there. What the hell? I don't know then. Is it bad? Last stream your voice was crisp. It's less so today. Not sure. Hmm. Oh, you know what it was? Hold on. No, maybe that's not it at all. Lots of static and you're loud. Okay, how about that? Is that better? Th that's what it was before? Alright, there you go. Alright, good. All fixed. I had to mess around with different microphones over the weekend because um, Discord doesn't like the XLR microphone. Can we donate more than 2,000 to start the race per stream? If it lets you, you can donate as much as you want. Okay, so we're playing Gravity Rush. We're playing on a PlayStation 5. Um, I'm not going to be able to hear the game all that well because I have to plug in a headset to my monitor in order to hear it. So the sound is being sent to the monitor and then it's being sent from the monitor to my headset and I can't really turn it up that loud. So we'll see how it goes, but you guys will probably be fine. If I do it any other way, then there's gonna be an echo. Um, so that's all we can do right now. Um, but thankfully I get to use my open ear micro my, my open ear headset so I get to have both ears on my, on my head for a change. So maybe it'll be fine. 
Um, I'm feeling pretty good today, but I might I might sound a little bit down because like uh, I didn't get much sleep last night. Um, so I'm like a, I'm like a, a bike in a JRPG. I am overly tired. So I'll do my best. Hopefully I park up a little bit. I've already ordered a coffee from the Lily Cafe, and we will see um, if that uh, perks me up a bit. We'll see. Anyway, let me my. PlayStation 5 is so dusty already. Let me get a blanket on because it's a little bit cold. But I'm, I'm uh, excited to play this game because I think I think it it might be a Joe game. I don't know. I, I know that there's a blonde with red eyes on the screen. So, uh, you know, assuming she's in her 20s, it's hard to tell with anime, then uh, maybe it's already a Joe game, but we'll see. All right, let me uh, start the game, and then after we start the game, I can set up some windows. Let's get some um, some visuals going. All right, and then we can also test the sound. So here we go. Gravity Rush Remastered, PlayStation Five. Engage. Well, that looks cool. Also, as always with a console game, I'm sitting much further away from the screen than I usually do when we play a game on PC. So. Bear with me there too, please. Hey, Gatsby. So there are going to be a bunch of Isaac Newton puns in this or whatever? Press X to tap the apple. Okay, so it's tracking my motion of the gamepad. Alright, I don't like that. Bad start. Bad start. Alright, I'm tapping the apple. Tapping the apple. So like QTE. Oh, four taps. Apple Chan, no! Well, that apple's not going to be in Gravity Rush 2. That's a very... Alright, how do we change it to English? Oh, this is a weep game. What the? Oh, uh, it's going to be an accordion weep game. Great. All right. All right, I know exactly how this is gonna go now. All right. All right, is that better, or is this still too loud? The visuals are mastered. A little louder, please. Really? We're hitting yellow. Do you do you want it to be a little louder? Not louder? Okay. Minus nine. Alright, there we go. Why is the G bigger? Gravity Rush.
Are you playing this on the Vita? I'm the biggest Vita stand in the world. Yes, I'm playing it on the Vita, of course. Oh, for fuck's sake. All right, here we go, meow. What are you doing here? Are you lost too? Well, I don't have anything to give you, so run along and find somewhere else to beg. Per. All right, do we have amnesia? Where am I? Yeah, here we go. Left stick to move, all right. Can't move the camera. Oh, now I can run. Oh, oh man, we're really, uh, we're really picking it up. Okay, getting some kind of eco vibes. All right, so do I? I not? I don't get to to control the camera in this game. Oh, that doesn't bode well. All right. Why can't I remember anything? Oh, we're girl! How did I end up here? I need to find a way out. Seek a way out. Where is everyone? So one from Oblivion. Why oh, can't it be from Skyrim? Huh? Let go. Plea, he plea, he please. I need. Grr. Gravity. Let go. Oh man, I made him fall down. I have the power of gravity. Bother someone else. What? Wait, you don't understand. I'm French, I gotta save my boy. Huh, your boy? What's, oh shit. He's this way, come on. Follow the mystery, mysterious man. All right. Whole story's gonna be about finding this boy. Okay, why does that sound weird? Oh, it's not just me. Oh, okay. It sounds like his voice is coming from a tiny, tiny little speaker that's across the room instead of, like, you know, in the room that we're in. Oh, what's going on in here? What crow? Siri, when did Gravity Rush come out? February 9th, 2012? 2012? Really? Oh man. I thought this was a new game. Or newish. Alright, are there any settings to fix this? Oh, controller speaker! Oh, that would be why! Alright, let's disable it. Is that better now? No, not really. Yuji! Oh, 
You can't fix the French. I don't want to fix the French. It sounds like the audio sounds washed out. What's going on? Ha hurry, you saw him up there. My boy's trapped in that house. He'll get taken by the storm. But what am I supposed to do? You're like that crow girl, right? Use your cat to get there and save him. Crow girl? What crow girl? Oh, drop the act. I saw you plunge from the sky and land without a scratch. Use that superpower of yours to go and go get my boy. Superpower? Crow? Under the table? Can you read the dialogue with a French accent? Not without getting cancelled, Iron Wrath. No, I can't. Oh, -ho. <laughs> wee wee! I don't have any superpower. <laughs> oh, they really is UG. All right. What is this? I'm I'm standing on the wall. Per. <laughs> Did you do this? Meow. Le meow. Head toward the marker. The number indicates how far you are. Right stick, look around. Oh, we can move the camera now. Okay. Press options and choose settings to adjust the camera setting. Now, this is all right. All right. Oh, no. Black old Chan, no. I made it. Okay, so I'm sorry, did we just get three tutorials in a row for the same fucking mechanic? I get it, all right. Hold on, kid. I'm coming. <laughs> oh, we're all messed up. What the heck was that? Oh, you can still move when you're floating, okay. Getting closer. Almost there. No, I don't want tilt controller. Can I turn that off? I really do not want to tilt controller. I, I never want that here. I just took a screenshot. All right. Please tell me I can turn that off. Motion sensor sensitivity just down to zero. All right, it's off now. Okay, good. Well, if you can do that, why do you need me? Oh, no one cares about that guy. All right, never mind. Oh, now we're both dead. Oh, we're not. Oh, okay.
<laughs> yeah. Thumbs up. Save this kid, by the way. They're making French sounds. Oh, you're so strong. What did you do? I, I I didn't. You didn't what? I actually saved my boy, not destroy my house. Our house. Give us back our house. What? 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 But I, it wasn't my fault. I was trying to stop it from falling. Great job you did that. I knew I shouldn't have trusted a gravity shifter. Bunch of good for nothing troublemakers. Oh man! In this game, everyone else is the fray. All of my mom's things were in that house. You have to bring it back now. No, I don't. I don't have to do anything. But. What the hell? I, I didn't do anything wrong. Hey, where are you going? Humph, shifters are all rotten. You said it, Pops. Uh. What was I supposed to do? I was only trying to help. Hmm, what is it? You see something? This reminds me of Final Fantasy VI music. A door. Time to roll some dice. Last dream must be. It's a cool place of fish to do one thing. Plus, you should do. Plans shall be man to rest up once shall fade. The blessing of low victory shall plan to the survey. What are you anyway? Were you the one changing gravity? Meow. Purr. Sigh. What now? I guess we're both alone, so we better stick together. Purr. I suppose I should give you a name, huh? How about Dusty? You like that? Here, Dusty. Here, Kitty Kitty. So, she looks different in-game than she does in these scenes, which also looks different than she does in the comic. That was an interesting choice. What? You don't like it? I think it's a great name. Huh? Was that a crow? Catch Dusty. All right. Oh, no, no, no. It's, we, we have to go this way. Okay. I also can't change gravity because we're not in an escape room. All right. So you want me to follow that crow? Okay. Catch the crow. All right, maybe we can use this wall to get up there. Oh, so now we can float. Tutorial available. The white navigation marker indicates where your next objective is. When off screen, the marker changes to an arrow to indicate its relative direction. Move the camera with the right stick to locate the objective. Okay. <sighs> Let me play. I hate video games. Stop in midair. How do I do that? I can stop in midair? Oh, I can. L1 returns to normal gravity, okay? Okay, I kind of get it. It's neat. All right. Oh, there's us, but better. Cool. Oh, 
Oh, she's evil for sure. That girl and her crow are kind of like us. Maybe she knows something. Right, I think I can... Okay, something about using the wall. Alright, here we go. I want to get that. Oh no, everyone else go... Wait, what? Did I just kill a bunch of people? Oh, we have gravity juice. You can't do it forever. This world is imperfect. <laughs> oh, we can fight now. Okay. Sign for the combat tutorial. Here we go. Episode 2 Shadows Over the City. You came just in time. I was chasing one of those thugs when I got surrounded and, well, you were amazing, but who are you? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, step aside, will ya? Oof. This is the girl I just saw. She's with that crow, too. Wanted, Raven. Now she's a crow. Uh, excuse me? Hmm? Who are you, and what are you doing here? I, uh, well, I don't remember. Huh? Oh, you talk like me. Yeah, I said I don't remember. Look, <laughs> I don't know who I am or what I'm doing here, but I think this girl might know. Really? <laughs> you don't remember anything? Did you bump your head or something? Do Nikito with a French accent? I don't... I can barely do Nikito! All right, how would it be? <laughs> well, this is like the start of one of those great suspense novels. Well, this is like the start of <laughs> the one of the, <laughs> the great suspense novel. <laughs> I can't do it. No, I don't think so. No, get away, huh? huh? What's this? Combat tutorial? What? What are those things? Defeat the monsters. Kick. R2 plus direction is evade, really? Okay, kind of cool. Oh no! Okay, so that is not how it works. Enemy marker. Any positions are indicated by a red enemy marker. When an enemy is off screen, the marker changes to an arrow to indicate its relative direction. Move the camera with the right stick to locate the enemy. Alright, thank you. It's my first idea. 
How do I get juice back? Oh, it just comes back. Okay. First that storm, now those monsters. What's going on around here? Well, yo, Officer Sid, reporting for duty. Where are you, man? You need to get out of here. Sid, Fall Fantasy? Huh? Why? Listen, the powers that be don't care for you shifters. You make them feel less, well, powerful. An unknown with superpowers who just happens to show up at the same time as the monsters, you don't want anyone making the log logical connection. Look, just leave the explanations to me. I'll take care of things. What connection? If you say so, good. Now get going. We'll meet again, shifter, in our swimsuits. Yo, Sid, where are you? It was the day the monsters came and attacked the city. I didn't know it yet, but that strange police officer, Sid, was going to play a big part in the events to come, and I never would have guessed the part I would myself have played. What, what, what is going on? What is going on? City shaken, recent rise in unexplained phenomenon. This is all over the fucking place so far. Holy shit, Mayor Balsi labels the monsters Nevi, form special police unit to deal with the menace. Officer Sid single-handedly takes down Nevi, apprehends thugs in process. Oh, okay. There you are, I was worried the city would forgotten to send someone. Huh, the city? Hey, this is no time for kidding around. You need to hurry up and refuel the fountain. It ran dry a few minutes ago. Fountain? What fountain? How do you refuel a fountain anyway? I agree. Sigh, it's so hard to find good help these these days. Look, I don't have time to explain. I don't have time to explain why I don't have time to explain. Just get over there. You know where the fountain is, don't you? Here, take this map just in case. Was I working for the city before? I can't remember. Roger, I'll get on that. Thanks for the map. How'd you know my name was Roger? Cat is chat in French. Isn't cat in French chat? View map. Next location. Select story mission icon. A man working for the city thought I was hired to help. The map he gave me came in handy, but I didn't understand how gravity energy worked. I wasn't sure what to do. He really needed the help, so I decided to give it a try. It would have been too difficult to explain that I had lost all my memories and didn't yet understand anything about the city, but he mentioned fixing the fountain, so that was what I decided to do. Alright, that's what we're doing. The fountain, got it? I'll see you there. And don't dawdle. Y yes, sir. What have I got myself into? I better go over there. Alright. So we're a bottom. Alright, cool. Where are we going? <laughs> Die! Die! <laughs> You're all screwed! You're all dead! Oh, I just murdered like eight people. Holy shit. Holy shit. Greetings. Come with me. <laughs> All right, now we're going to stop. Oh, they're dead. Are we're mean? So is the sound kind of like tinny and drowned out for you all too? Or is it just for me because I'm on the headset plugged into the monitor? It sounds so weird. Sounds fine. You constantly play weeb games. I know you watch anime. I don't watch anime. I don't. 
The, what do you think the marble race is for? I really don't. I don't even. I don't even watch regular TV. I don't even watch normie TV. We don't even have a couch right now. All right. Couchless, yeah, it's a speedrun percent. Yeah, it's a speedrun category. We just have a big beanbag chair. No couch, and where do you eat? At the kitchen table, like an adult, with my family. No toys at the table. I'm not kind of dad. Greetings, everyone. Let's go for a ride. Ha <laughs> Get fucked. Later. Why are you immune to, uh, to gravity powers? Oh, no. He's boring and annoying. Whoa. Oh, it's true, but whoa, you don't have to say it. What the hell? Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Thank you, Mark Espresso, for the resub. Thank you, Somnus Gwent, for the resub as well. Thank you. <sighs> Thank you, Daddy's Jizzies, for the resub. Thank you, Asa Goan, for the resub as well. Crazy Fist, Jansoft88, Tell69, Gerson LCS Jr., Garlic Bread, spelt oddly. I had garlic bread for lunch, it was really good. Mr. Silver Strike, Grim Grum, all for resubs. Zorgrox for some bits. Desirio for the resub, Bunny in Boots 24 for the resub, Oso Bears for the new sub, welcome to the Gravity Rush, uh, I don't know a group that starts with R, what's a group that starts with R? The Gravity Gang will work, yeah, Gravity, welcome to the Gravity Gang, the Gravity Rush Rebels, nah, the Gravity, oh, the Gravity Rush Redditors, that's good. Welcome to the Gravity Rush Redditors. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, Ryan Mulvey, for the resub. Inalib as well. P Kill Boredom. Drusta. Chen Dizzy. Or Chen Desi. Jahions. Sly K9. What on earth is this name? Himblo, Mimblo, Bimblo, Zimblo. For the resub, that was a minefield. Holy crap. Thank you very much. Thank you also to my crawlogist for gifting out a sub to a sub to Zestorin. And last but not least, A Christ for the resub. Thank you very much. Oh, also thank you, Lily. Say that three times fast. That, 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 that. Yes, let's begin mission. It's about time. You better get started collecting fuel. Collecting fuel, right. Uh, how do I do that? What is this? Your first day on the job? Yes, you need to grab those precious gems floating in the air and bring them down to fuel the furnace. So I have to collect floating gems. Stay with me, kid. This is serious business. Now get up there and grab those gems. Okay, so... Everyone hates the, the gravity rushers. However, they also employ them to do menial tasks like refuel the fountain and then hate them, but then also like them. But they're responsible for the monsters, but they're also part of the, the workforce here. Okay. I hope they're safe to just grab with my bare hands. Your hands are pretty normal to me. Find 10 precious gems. Oh, great. Okay. So it's, it's, it's going to be this kind of game. All right.
Okay, that's way close. So I can get on it now, right? Deposit gems in the furnace. Okay. Joe, this girl or TB? How dare you even ask me that? Yay, now everyone can enjoy the fountain. It's working. New challenge mission unlocked. Is it? Now do it faster. Well done, well done. You didn't even use an insta collector to grab those gems. I'll be sure to put in a good word for you with the city. In fact, would you be willing to work full time for us, getting all the other city facilities up and running? It'd be a snap for someone with your skill. Wow, I must have really impressed him. Feels kind of nice. Uh, sure, I'd be happy to help with the other facilities, but can I stay part time? Ooh, woo. Well, yeah, I suppose it's more your. Th if it's that's that's more your thing. Such a terrible waste of your talents, though. Anyway, here, take these three gems as pay for a job well done. Is it nice to get paid for your services? If you ever change your mind about going full-time, you just let me know. Thank you, sir. Wait, aren't these these some of the gems I just collected? Cat's powers can now be upgraded. Oh, we're, we're, our name is Cat, not... I thought the cat's name was Cat. Okay. Gravity Rush 2 is a 2B outfit. Yeah, I know! I, of course I know. I know. Affects the rate which your gravity gauge drains. Use gems to fill up and decrease the rate. Okay, how do I do this? Alright, so we get gems. We need 50 gems. Learner's permit. Okay, I want to do this quest. Challenge odd nor time attack. Take the challenge. Yeah, sure. Why are there enemies? Oh, we got a lot of gems for this. Defeat as many Nevi as possible in the time limit. Increasing the time limit by defeating enemies. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Dogs, what are you doing, man? Okay, so so far, I mean, 
it's kind of cool, but it's also awkward as fuck. I guess it's, there's a there's a learning curve to it. Oh, I thought I was on it. Never mind. Alright, we got 790 points. How far off were we? Oh wow, you can do way better. Holy shit. You can do way better than that. Alright, so using more gravity powers instead of like, um, instead of punching, I'm guessing. I give Gyro a try at low sensitivity for small adjustments. Do you think so? I don't, I just I don't like it when I like move the uh, the controller. It it kind of moves the camera for me. Uh, I'll keep it as it is right now. But if I, if I still have problems, I'll try it later. Oh, you can upgrade your powers too. Affects the power of your standard kicks, including chain kicks and counter attacks. There are counter attacks. Use gems to level up to increase their power or extend the length of your combos. Okay, so we can upgrade ourselves and then get way way better shit later stasis field we have a stasis field wall floating gravity kick all right that seems pretty good affects how frequently you can evade Effects the power of your sliding kick attacks. Use what's what's sliding kick? I think like just getting more gauge is better right now, right? Maybe some more health too. Let's just increase the the base stats, right? Hey, don't take this the wrong way, but you're a bit ripe. Have you had a bath lately? Oh, where are we? What? I can't be that bad. Sniff, whoa. Or maybe I can. Your hair is a mess and your clothes are covered in dirt. What have you been up to anyway? A girl needs to keep her appearance up. I do need a bath and my clothes do need washing. Come to think of it, I really do need to find, a pla find myself a place to sleep too. Okay, that was, that was the whole conversation. All right, nice. Nice. All right, is this the place to go or what? What's this? Begin the mission. I don't know what, what what mission. What mission? What are we talking about? Oh, we can just find gems in the world. Oh, it's like Crackdown. Okay, that's interesting. I guess. Except Crackdown sucked. All right, can we get up there now? Crackdown one was great. Oh, what? Run around the city collecting orbs so you can get better at collecting orbs the game? I played the demo and had a good time and I was like, I don't need to buy the game now. I've seen what this is. Yeah, it was great. Yeah, for, for like, you know, five minutes. Try R2 and L2 on the ground. R2? Alright, so R2 is, is dodge. We knew that already. What's L2? L2 does nothing. What about both? Okay, I don't get it. It's like we're falling but sliding at the same time. Is it even faster?
It goes up buildings. I don't think it does. It do well, I I'm I'm doing it. It's not doing it. Do I have to hit um this button to do it? Now that I've changed gravity, it does. Stand on the wall then. Okay, well then, that's just changing gravity with extra steps. That's just that's just a normal ass slide at that point because I'm just changing gravity to do it. Now the, now the wall is the floor. So it doesn't go up buildings. It just works on whatever the currently the floor is. Alright, where are we going? Oh, okay. Out of bounds. What? What just happened? Was I wandering too far away from town? Meow. too far okay so where did it say to go all right so that's information next location challenge mission challenge mission all right there's lots of challenge missions all right so this is like is it like a small open world hub home sweet home i just wanted to catch a break more than anything i needed a place to just be my, by myself and think now if that place happened to come with a shower and a means of doing laundry all the better i could definitely use have used a little cleaning up all right do you have a change of clothes like what's going on Oh, this is the place. Okay, so red is the main objective. Okay. How am I supposed to get by in this place? No home, no place to take a hot shower. Man, they're really hyping up the shower scene. Ah, I mean, you literally have gravity powers. Just float as soon as you start falling. Nope, we're dumb. Okay, never mind. Ow, ow. Damn, all these poses. Oof. Ugh. Huh? Hmm, not bad. Oh, look, a shower. Oh, a place to sleep. Not bad at all. Maybe I... Oh, oh, really? Maybe I'm gonna be okay. This place looks built to last. Alright, so we're a sewer rat? Huh. What do you know? It leads right outside. All right, looks like I just found my new home. Home sweet home, did you? Gather furniture for the new room. This place could you <laughs> Fall, falls from the sky, rescue, so, rescue somebody, fight some monsters. Someone shows up, say, hey, here's a job, says yes, sir, and does it. Walks away, looks like this, Falls into a sewer, decides, hey, I guess I live here now. What, what the fuck is this? This place could use some sprucing up. I guess we should start with the furniture. Dusty, what do you think? Any ideas? Meow? All right, then. Huh? What was that scream? Was that a scream? Hey, somebody help help me. Hey, weebs love her, man, because if she loves living in a sewer, then, you know, the... the, the Disaster that's your that's your room is gonna be fine for her Tell her to clean it up and she'll do it. Did you hear that? Sounds like she needs our help Meow, where is she? We better find her fast This is completely different than what we just oh no that that led outside, okay, I understand I understand What is this that we just got? Whoa, 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 why did it fix gravity? What is this? 
Oh, there's so much XP gems over there. Wait, what? Joe, are you going to pretend that a house with four kids is cleaner than a weeb's room? Yes. I am extremely confident about that. Oh, we're not. Okay, okay, never mind. Okay, I feel like we're on the underside of it. Is that is that why it doesn't make sense to me? Okay. The enemy gate is down. Alright, it's a little finicky, but it's fine. So, if we land on a surface that has normal gravity, does it automatically know that? And let's, let's, let's find out. Okay, so if I'm here and I land on this wall, then it's still going to drain. It's still draining my power, right? But if I land on this surface, even without pressing L1... No, it's still draining it. Now I press L1. Hmm. Okay, so... I do have to be aware of what surface I'm on. Alright, it's not always going to tell me. Alright. You're slightly sideways. Oh, is it, I wasn't perfectly on it? Alright, hold on. Let, let's, let's find out. Alright, so this is normal gravity at this point. So as I move around... Okay, yeah, it, it automatically put it on there. Okay. Alright, so it will tell me if I'm on normal gravity. Alright, cool. And where are we going? We're going... We're going uh, down there. All right. We're not. I don't know where we're going. Okay, this is... Very confusing, but kind of cool. I, I like the movement so far. It's fun. I don't like the combat. And I don't like the style. And I don't like the sound. And I don't like the main character. And I don't like the story. And the controls and camera are a little awkward. And, like, flinging yourself around gravity is a little odd. But I do like the concept. That's, that's kind of cool. What is this? I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a gravity reboot, a uh, refill. Okay. So it's like getting your jump back in Celeste or your dash back in Celeste. All right, Celeste was so influential. What was that one? Health? Oh no! Shit, where were we? Are you alright? The monsters are gone. You're safe now. Thank you. Oh, thank you. I'm not sure I approve of that outfit, but I suppose I'm in no position to complain. Alright. Boomer core. Huh? What's wrong with my outfit? 
it is kind of weird. Um, so where is your house? Will you be able to get get home okay? I'll be fine. I'm old, not dead, you know. But boy, I can't wait to give that daughter-in-law of mine a piece of my mind. She sent me to get rid of this chair, and look what happened. I bet this was a setup. A chair, you say? Here, why don't you let me take care of that? You should go back home and rest. We're just... <laughs> Now we're just picking up trash for our for our trash lair. What is this game? <laughs> what the you help a poor old woman? Oh, I wish my daughter-in-law was more like you. Why oh I back in my day? This sounds like my signal kinda run. I am. Oh, look at the time. I better hurry and get rid of this chair for you. Generate stasis field. What? Hauling objects with the stasis field. Press circle next to grab objects in the stasis field. Anything trapped in this field will travel to you as you move. If you run out of energy, you'll drop what you're carrying. Alright, can we take her with us? So it's like the gravity gun? Do we get a trolley? Perfect. I'm starting to get into this. What should we get next? Hmm, what to do about the rest of the furniture? Maybe I should ask around. <laughs> Just got here. What's this game about? This game is about furnishing our sewer apartment. This is what the game's about. Calculated. Come on. Really? Exactly where I wanted to go, nice. Hey, got any free furniture? I'm so sick of studying at that desk. Studying don't mean nothing in the end. I want to experience things firsthand. Oh, I'll take the desk off your hand, then you won't be tempted to study anymore. I'm dumping the desk and heading out on the road to live life as a free man. Education enslaves the soul. True! Actually, if you're gonna throw the desk away, can I have it? I've been looking for one. Please, take it off my hands. I never want to see it again. It's back in the alley over there. From now on, I'm just living like the wind for me. Woo. Not sure what's gone, gone into him, but it works out well for me. Thanks, I'll take good care of it. Aw oh, man, free desk. Free desk? Joe, would you play this in VR? Nope. I would puke, for sure. This is not a desk. This is not a desk. It's not a desk. My room's starting to come together. Having my own place is kind of exciting.
Is there a serious story to this game chat or is it just furnish your sewer apartment and then do some more work to get an even better apartment maybe in in the alley upstairs just tuned in I'm so confused I've been here for the whole time and I'm so confused I don't know why like Anime games can still just have the power to just absolutely gobsmack me with just, just off the wall batshit. I I just, I wasn't expecting to have to like play a girl who's like, oh my god, my own place in the sewer. I'm so excited. Time to get furniture. Hey, do you have any furniture? Yo, cat girl, it's me. Yep, it's you, all right, cat girl. You talking about me? Of course. Who else? You're the talk of the town. You're the black cat girl. Cat girl, hmm, it's got a nice ring to it. Hey, you don't remember your name, right? Good, it's settled then. I'll call you Cat. You can call me Sid. Boy, when he makes up his mind, he makes up his mind. Well, I guess I do need a name. I suppose Cat's not bad. Not bad, it's perfect. Trust me, it suits you. Meow. By the way, you won't believe what the boss had me do just now. He's moving, so I have to haul his old bed and dump it off somewhere. Is that crazy or what? Wait, did you say bed? Man's not. It's not that, like, total abuse of... Is that not like total abuse of authority or what? Do you have any idea how heavy that thing was? I could have thrown my back out. Yeah, yeah, sounds rough. So where is it exactly? I need a bed. Huh? You want that old thing? Well, it's yours if you can figure out how to carry it. I dumped it off by the old factory. The old factory? Got it. And Sid, thanks. I like my new name. No problem, cat. Consider a little reward for your help earlier. Good luck carrying that thing. <sighs> What are we? <laughs> What's that? Oh no! Oh, why is it hot? What the fuck? Nevi cores. All Nevi have red cores that service their eyes and their weak points. Destroy the cores and you destroy the Nevi. Okay. Pixar mommy <laughs> Holy sh <laughs> All right, we got him. All right. Oh, there's more! I was still liking the game so far. It's all right. It's definitely better than Pizza Tower. Well, I know it's not saying much. Nah, Pizza Tower was okay. Not as good as Forspoken. Yeah, well, what is? Oh my god, okay. No mattress?
Do you think gravity powers would be more or less intuitive in real life? Uh, way less intuitive. Well, actually, I don't know. Like, you could feel it more instead of having to, to, to look at her hair moving or whatever. I don't know. I... I would say less intuitive. In general, I think things in real life are going to be less intuitive than a video game. Oh, we're a menace. That covers it. Wait, where did we get the blankets and the mattress from? Uh, okay, I kind of feel like the comic is operating under its own canon. Comic is just riffing, man. Thank you, Lakovsky, for the new sub. Welcome to the Gravity Rush Redditors. Thank you, Waifu Joe, for the resub. Thank you, Humble Guard, as well. And Anumi for the resub. Ah. At the time, I was just happy to find a place to lay my my tired head. I tried my best to scrounge together whatever furniture I could find. What's happening? La la la. How you doing, laundry? Wait. I, oh. Queen of the trash. A girl's home really is her castle. Uh, everything was still so new and confusing, but I was happy to finally have a place where I could get away from it all. Congratulations on finding a home. Home. From home, you can save your progress or instantly travel through Hexaville sewer system to any of the special manholes you've previously discovered. Save here to keep track of power-up levels and gems collected since the last autosave. She loves manholes. Manhole travel. A few of Hexville's manholes lead back to your home. You can travel freely between your home and any of the manholes you've previously discovered. Be sure to keep an eye out for them. Now that I've got my home in order, I should take a look around town. Should we? Warp costume save. Alright, let's save it, obviously. Costume. Complete side mission, Rules of War, to activate this out uh, outfit. Diary of a Maid. Excuse me? 101 nights to access this outfit. A time to play. Is that a schoolgirl outfit? What, what are we doing, anime? All right, let's go to here. Oh, I can't. I don't have any, uh, I, have, I haven't found any manholes. How does the sewer connect to different floating parts of a city? The pipes go between them? Which is better movement? This is Forspoken. Um, at this, at, judging this against Forspoken at the at the level of the game, this for sure. But like, if we're judging this against the moveset that we currently have in Forspoken after playing it for so long, I think Forspoken has better movement. Oh, we found another manhole. Nice. Hey. We had enough trouble with the gravity storms now we've got weird creatures running around what's going on here those creatures weren't here before now nah, they started showing up with the storms thought my mind was playing tricks on me at first okay thank you very cool
Actually, it is kind of like Forspoken, isn't it? You get, instead of mana, you're collecting these XP gems. It's encouraging moving around. The main character is also a complete disaster. The combat sucks. Yeah, damn, all these Forspoken, uh parallels that we can do. You know what? Let's turn off. Let's just play more Forspoken. Chat loves Forspoken. Step away from the ledge. Wait, you can see me, can't you? Uh, yeah? Why wouldn't I be able to see you? It's not like you're a ghost or anything. Actually, I am. Finally, I've been wandering the world for ages thinking no one would ever see me again. Who are you? What makes you different? What? Um, I'm Cat, and I have no idea what you're talking about. Cat, oh, it's so wonderful to meet you. I thought I really was a ghost, the way everyone failed to notice me. Well, until you came along. My apologies, I'm not making any sense, am I? Nope, none at all. My name's Singlor. I'm a scientist, or was anyway. There was an accident at the lab. The energy that was released knocked my wife and I into a different space-time dimension. What? Apparently, I can see everyone, but no one can see me. The gravitational field that surrounds this world is so powerful that it distorts the passage of time. What the? Hold on. Something wrong? Is it me or did you just vanish for a second? Hmm, perhaps you're being able to see me as a result of our respective space-time dimensions overlapping, in which case... Ah, he's gone. He wasn't lying? Wait, hold on. Was it you just fucking with me, cat? He just turned into the cat. And we never saw him again. I'm enjoying getting these orbs. He's McKeezy's dad from Steins Gate. Spoilers. What the hell? My dad was working on finding a way to do time travel, and then one day he just disappeared when he said, I'm going to go try and use my special time traveling hot air balloon. I saw him float off into the sky, and I never saw him again, but he's dead for sure. Absolutely dead. No other way. Nothing else happened to him. He's gone, dead, buried. We never did find a body or recovered his, hot, his time traveling hot air balloon, but he's dead for sure. It's also kind of weird that he based his time-traveling hot air balloon on the wreckage of a time-traveling hot air balloon that he found in a jungle that looks suspiciously like his. In fact, they would look pretty identical. But nah, he's dead for sure. Where are we going? Alright, I can put this on the map, right? Home check, interior design check. It was time to leave the neighborhood and start exploring, but I need to get around and start talking to people in the city. Okay. So now that I have that, is it going to show up on the map? It is. Cool. Alright. Hey there, have you heard the Hexville Van- he Hexi- Hexiville? Hexville? Hexville Phantom alias left another calling card. Alias? You never heard of Alias? He's the terror of the city, young young lady. Data pawn? And now that- and now that thief is after Aldnor's sacred gem. Alright, that was it. Alright, thank you, cool. Persona?
Sid, what? You off today or something? I didn't recognize you with that coat, huh? Oh, this? Pretty sharp, huh? It's like Gumshoe and Nagito smushed together. Well, you're looking at the newest member of the Seahorse Special Crime Task Force. I made detective. Oh, there we go, yeah. Oh, yeah, is that a good thing? Not good. Great. I got promoted and keep this on the down low, but I'm on a job. Yeah, I saw the papers. Thanks to me, you got promoted. Exactly. And once again, your time is impeccable. I need your help. The, this new case could really boost my career. Hasn't it been like an hour? Mm-hmm. Right. So I do all the work while you get all the promotions. Pretty sweet deal. But she's going to do it because she's, uh, you know... This isn't just any case. I got we got a tip on a master criminal on a master criminal alias. Oh, that's the guy I just heard about. Oh damn! What a coinky dink! I can smell the bonus already. Heck, maybe I'll even get another promotion. Don't worry, you'll be rewarded. I've got just a plan to catch the thief. Come on, cat, are you in? Herc. Popeye? Well, well. Now I see why you weren't responding to my calls. Come on, man. Now's no time for getting your groove on. What? With her? No way. She's just some girl I know. And she smells. Like, actually. Get get back to work. This isn't a game, you know. This is the real DL. Yes, sir. What's that? Cat, I'll be in touch. Come on, Sid. Get the, get the let out. Yes, sir. Hmm. <laughs> Kiss up. Oh, worse. We steal. We're a stealer. The Hexville Phantom. The. Yeah, uh huh. This is Cat. Sit here. Head to the roof on that church and don't get spotted by the trolls. Oh, he gave it to us. All right, we didn't steal. Huh? What will happen if they see me? You think? You think I was a thief here? Calm down. Calm down. Just go to the roof. I'll fill you in on the rest of the master plan once you get there. Over. Click. What? Hello? Hello? Hmm. That was rude. All right. Where's the roof? Sneaking by the police. The police are on high alert thanks to Alias. If you get too close to an officer, they'll grow suspicious. Run away before the level reaches 100 or you'll get spotted. Sneaking by the police too. Wow, it's the, it's the the sequel to the last tutorial we just read. If you enter an area that's under heavy watch, you'll be spotted instantly. Be sure to avoid any direct confrontation with the guards. The police will begin to relax once again once you stay out of sight for a while. Intruder spotted in the restricted access zone. Crap, they saw me. All units seek out and apprehend the suspect. Don't let her get away. Uh, I put them on alert. I better lay low and let things cool down for a bit. Meow. I'll be sorry for sure if I take the easy route. Maybe we can try going in from the side. Or maybe we can just go over here and fly across. When do I get a slingshot weapon? What do you mean? What, what's seeing me? Shoot, they found me. I should try shifting around the sides of the island. Okay, are we almost here? I think we're we're kind of here. Oh shit! All right, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh oh, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it! Yes! All right. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh. 
No, 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 Beep. Uh, hello? Oh, Sid, what now? Who else were you expecting? Alright, can you see the park from the, from there? On top of that fish statue in the middle of the, is the sacred gem. Alias is after. That gem's been protecting the city for a long time. We can't afford to lose it now with all these storms. Legend tells of a great power hidden inside it. Yeah, yeah, who cares? You don't say. If it's so powerful, why is it out in the open? That thing by your feet is the fake gem I made, or some say fake. I see a bell. I'm going to raise a bit of a ruckus to draw the police away. That'll be your chance to switch the real gem with the fake one. Got it? Later. Got it? Good. La okay, so... So, so he's the thief. So he, he's, he's the thief. Alright. Click. Wait, are you si Oh, Sid's, Sid's plan sounds terrible. I hope nothing goes wrong. You know what we're going to do? We're going to steal it first. Hey, there's a noise coming from the woods. Maybe it's Alias. Sid's getting their attention. Now's my chance to pull a switcheroo. There aren't many police that way. I can try and sneak around there. God damn it. God damn it. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. What if I thread the needle? If I thread the needle, like right, like right here, thread right, right, right through them. Thread the needle. Nah, I can't thread the needle. You can't thread the needle. What if I go like a little to the left first? Oh man, they're so good. What? All right, can I kill them? Old Joe would have kept trying. Are her thighs compressed under those things? Those look so uncomfortable. What? Beep beep. Okay, I switched up the real gem with the fake. Great, I knew I could count on you. Now bring the real gem over to me here in the woods. The officers on guard duty are going to going back to the patrols, so be careful not to get spotted, alright? See you soon. Click Sheesh. I wish he would take this more seriously. He's making me nervous. It's called skin dentation, and it's art. I mean, when it's on 2B, it's art, but here, I don't think so. All right, so I'm just, I'm just leaving. I'm just walking out of here. Nope, 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 nope. I'm not just walking out of here. Nope. How? 
shoot, they found me. Okay, like it's right here. So we just we just pop up and go. All right, we did it. All right. Nice work, Cat. With the sacred gem swapped out for the Fake, nobody will have a clue as to what happened. To It'll be our little secret. Hehehehe. <laughs> huh? What's up with Sid all of a sudden? Um, Sid, is something wrong? Hey, by the way, there's a party going down back at the park you really shouldn't miss. Finally, the gem is mine. <laughs> Sid. Wait, it actually was the plan, though? Ugh, my head. Wait, you're him too, huh? What's going on here? You were just here, and then you weren't, and now you're there. What are you doing? One second, I was standing around waiting, and the next, I was lying on the ground. Wait, so that other you, was that alias? Because if it was, I just handed him the sacred gem. Ugh, sacred gem? What? That's not good. That's not good at all. How was I supposed to know he wasn't you? He had your face. Be sit here where are you dimwit get back here immediately the nevi there click boss boss come in what happens this is bad we have to get back to the park sounds like the nevi are there all right well i can't get caught by the by the, the helicopter okay, i don't understand what just happened defeat the nevi Man, it's like Sonic Adventure, but worse. Too far. Yeah, probably. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That 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 was too far. Oh no! Calculated. It was set up. Oh, it worked! that miss do 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 Thank you, Solisk, Solisk, for the new sub. Welcome to the Gravity Rush Redditors. <laughs> Thank you, Verdox Five, for the resub. Josh P, 
Pennington as well for the resub, and Booba Admirer for the resub. Not much here for you, I'm afraid, but, you know, maybe next game. That takes care of those Nevi, huh? No need to, uh, what are you guys staring at? What, what did we do? We didn't do anything. Uh-oh. Hmm. This isn't good. Wait, I can explain. You see, I, um, calm down. No need, no need to panic. Here, open wide. What the heck are you? Patui, blit. It's, it's just candy? Exactly. Alias switched up the gut treasure with this enormous gum, gum drop. He's a clever criminal. Okay, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. So, the whole time we were talking to Alias. So, what exactly was the plan? She must be in cahoots with him. He couldn't have done this alone. Well, no, actually. She's an accessory. Take her back to the station. Hey, uh, boss, I don't think she's with Alias. Who the fuck is this normal-ass person? <laughs> Who is this, this normal guy? <laughs> Co comic illustrator stand in it's just a just a normal guy if she were in league with the guy why would she still be here and why would she have helped to fight off those monsters oh and why's that we'd be dead if it weren't for her hmm that's true but hey he's still holding her hey leave her alone she's doing more for us than than you cops are yeah don't drag th that poor girl into this she's innocent she saved my kid and then broke my house it, it broke even look we need to find Ilias. he could be he could still be any so could still be around here somewhere i had a lot of trouble reading today sorry i'm really tired um search the grounds i want alias found no excuses move 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 so says mr stewart thanks cat thanks kate even after all this time, I still remember that day when the people of Hexville stood up for me. I still feel felt like a stranger in a strange land, but I was starting to like the place. Back to my my sewer home. Do 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 do. Oh, he's a bad alias. Heh. <laughs> you better get your head in the game, or you won't survive our next meeting. Poor lost queen. Wait, what? We're a lost queen? Why are we so subservient then? All right, where are we going now? Oh, we're a queen piece on the board. Oh, okay, I guess we are a lost queen. All right. Save point. Information. Let's go to let's go to information. An old man's wrath. Try air kicking to get around? What do you mean air kicking? Like this? Is it faster? Wait, you can see me? Ever since Alias came around, there's been nothing but trouble with all the storms in the Nevi. What are the government and the police Where are the government and the police during all this? Hmm, bunch of layabouts. Who's growing the food? Well, I can't argue with that, especially about one policeman in particular. The sacred gem was the only thing protecting us. I hope that Alias gets what's coming to him. Is a big tower. Oh, that's where the apple fell. Okay. So it's not just the apple that fell, we fell. Maybe we were the apple. Maybe it was the symbolic apple. We're the apple of this world. They're just growing anime girls up there on that tree. Anime girls really do grow on trees. 
Which makes sense, because they're usually drawn on paper, and that's where paper comes from. Fix Old Nor's elevator. Gems required 10. Okay. I'll fix it. How are you liking the game so far? It's pretty good. It's a bit awkward, but it's alright. I like the moving around. I like movement systems in games. The combat's ass. Why do I need an elevator? I can fly. It's working. New challenge mission unlocked. Oh, that's why. Okay. Oh, where are we going? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, do we want to upgrade anything? I'm gonna guess yes. Chat, am I right in my instincts in that we should just be upgrading the gauge more than anything else to get more gravity juice? In fact, level four or five, what does that mean? Oh, we can't upgrade anymore. So do we, do we need another like, um, like a big story upgrade and then we can upgrade to 10 and then we need another big story upgrade and then we can upgrade to 15? All right, combat powers might be good too to get next because I don't really like the combat all that much and get having more damage might be, might be better. Okay. Stasis field. All right, let's try this. Okay, your gravity gauge is empty. Grab gems to fill it and make your way to the goal. All right, record. All right, so shit, it's a race. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, already fucked it up. You know what, let's just run first and see. So we're just running, we're running, we're running. We're sliding now. We have a full gauge. I lied. Go in the thing, go in the thing. Oh, we did it. Alright. Alright, I th I think I think we can get gold. I think we can get gold. Easy peasy, easy peasy, easy game, easy life. Okay, I'm gonna guess these get much harder later on. Uh, 
It's because of OC Joe! <laughs> I couldn't get gold for three hours! Okay, shifting speed seems pretty good. Hold, hold X while falling. Wait, what? We can do what now? Oh. Is that like if you fall any direction? Oh. Okay, is kicking better though? Man, I'm getting some big Genshin Impact vibes. Uh-oh. Oh, more gems calculated. That reminds me, do you know when you're going to play Persona 3? Not trying to rush you, just curious. Not trying to gravity rush me? Okay, um, we're going to probably play Persona 3... Probably before Three Houses, but definitely after Metal Gear Solid. So I don't know exactly when, but it's definitely going to be after Metal Gear Solid and possibly before Three Houses. Okay, let's see. If I if I jump here and I kick. Okay, so that's that. All right, that's where we came from, right? So now let's try Okay, it feels about the same, actually, doesn't it? So if I upgrade it, that's going to be even faster. Any word on what version of Persona 3? Probably the the one that's on PC. Sorry, I don't I don't know if I want to do any of the other ones. But if you guys like have get enough of a stink, then maybe. Oh, we can increase our sliding speed with gravity slide. Hmm. Let's do that. Portable ruins the entire presentation. Well, that's why we're playing it on PC. We're not playing the portable. Like, I'm not going to play it on my Steam Deck. Oh, you can move a little bit while you're, um, while you're falling. I thought it was only after you lost your gravity that you could. Hmm. Okay, I have to say, I am just enjoying, um, just fucking around. That's usually a good sign that I'm enjoying a game, is when I just, like, just fucking around. I used to idle in World of Warcraft a lot, like, in, um, in the different major cities. And I would, like, pretend the floor is lava, and I would, like, create these arbitrary routes of, for myself, of, like, getting around, jump from lamppost to lamppost, that sort of thing. Okay, what's that? Oh, a shortcut. All right, we got it. It's already unlocked. All right, let's actually go to the next area. Oh, it's right here. That's nice. Oh, should we go get all the information? Let's go get all the information. It's important to me. I want to know all the lore of Gravity Rush. What do you know? I stood here, just like she told me, and boom, a cute girl appears. Oh, okay, cool, where? That fortune teller is around the money. 
Cute girl, me? And what fortune teller? Hmm, I was trying... I was hoping for someone a little fairer. What? Maybe I'll try my luck at Pandora's fortunes again. What? You're not so hot yourself, buddy. Yeah, I don't like this character. <laughs> Good. What? Well, hold on. I haven't seen enough of her attitude to know, but her visual design, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not really digging it. She looks like a 15-year-old going trick or treating. I, I'm not, I'm not a fan. In the comics or whatever, she looks better, but like here, like I don't know what the fuck is going on right now. What's the green? Challenge mission. All right, let's let's do the challenge mission. Gems required. Are the visuals significantly improved in Gravity Rush 2? Hold on. Siri, when did Gravity Rush 2 come out? G 2017. Oh, that's even further away than I thought, too. Alright, I thought it was more recent. 2017. Okay. Okay, free race. Pass through every checkpoint and complete the race. Alright, use gravity every trick every gravity trick at your disposal to win. Oh shit. Three, two. Oh oh no! Alright, 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 alright. We can do it. Oh Excuse me, I'm racing! Excuse me! Excuse me! What? Why is it this way? Why? Why would you do that? God, we would have made it too. That was all on you. Do you understand how, like, chat has, like, completely destroyed all their integrity forever? Because the time that you all disagreed with Zoro about whether or not there was an echo in his own music. It's so hard to take anything you guys say seriously now. I'm holding art. Why was that so awkward? No, no. Yeah, we did it. No, what the?
All right, there we go. There we go. We did it. We did it. Thank you, Sided Williams, for the new sub. Welcome to the, the Gravity Gang. What should we upgrade now? Shifting speed? Kick? Kick? What what was the uh, the game we played where it was kick? Was it Silent Hill? Sliding kick. What's sliding kick? Recovery time doesn't seem to be that important, actually. I think I would rather have maybe shifting speed. Because we're using that. A oh, reputation freshman flyer. Okay. I will say this. I enjoyed that the um, the upgrades so far are like making you the game feel better to play in, instead of just being like, oh, you do more damage. It's kind of boring. So I like that. That's pretty cool. Oh, that does feel faster. That's good. Pandora's Fortunes. Let Pandora open the box to your soul. Hmm, I wonder if she can shed some light on my situation. Meow. What is it, Dusty? You're cu you curious too? Let's see what she has to say. Well, you know what they say about curiosity. Um, excuse me? The shifter without a pass. The drift on the river of, forge of forgetfulness. And also, Joe can't read. I've been expecting you, Cat. Have you? How do you know my name? You are lost. You seek to ask, who am I? And why am I here? Well, now that you mention it... And that cat-like creature. Your fateful meeting has brought you power. That's amazing. How did you know all that? I have the radio. Say hello, Pandora. <laughs> hello, Pandora! Hello, I see all. I know all. Oh, boy. Hmm, what's that, Pandora? This young lady is about to meet a man who will change her destiny. What? A man? Who, who? Your fates are intertwined. Together, you will open the door to a new world. I like the sound of that. Forget my past. Tell me more about this meeting with Mr. Destiny. What's that, Pandora? He's where? And this envelope contains instructions to find him? And it only costs 100 gems? Huh, what a bargain. I'll take that. Thanks for the fortune. That envelope also has the bill. You can pay on the way out. Come again to Pandora's Fortunes anytime you seek wisdom. Okay. How are we paying for it? A meeting with Destiny. There goes my meal budget. That teller cost me a fortune. Alright, let's check the instructions here so we can hurry up and find Mr. Destiny. Wow, I can barely read her writing. The white flyer, the blue flag on high, the red runners, the open gateway, and the invitation underground. Um, okay then. I don't get this new age nonsense. Hmm, wait, is that Pigeon the White Flyer? Uh, wait, are, are we York now? White Flyer in the car. I caught it! I was on it! What the Shoot, I lost it. Okay, so it's not catch it, it's follow it. Shoot, it flew off on me. Even if I could catch catch up, how would I know which one was the right white flyer? Sniff, sniff. Huh? Is someone crying? I can sniff birds. I'll tell you which bird is different. Okay, now it's time for a break. Enjoy the sound of a child crying. You can know what it's like to be me. 
be back in five minutes. I'm gonna go pee and get a drink. Alright chat, I'm back. I gravity rushed there, I'm back. Sniff, I, I can't find my daddy. I want my daddy. The 
kid can't be Mr. Destiny, my Mr. Destiny, that'd be a little weird. What? Hey there, little guy, what's wrong? Did you get split up from your dad? I was in a tunnel and Anne Sniff, when I came out, it went away too. Now it's a wall. What a coincidence. Cat's trying to find her daddy too. The kid's trying, crying up a storm, but I can't make any sense of what he's going on about. Are you lost? Where did you last see your father? Um, well, I saw someone wearing blue in the tunnel, and I thought it was my dad, but he went away. Blue, is that the blue flag part of the prophecy? Hold on a second, okay? I need to check something real quick. Pull out the letter. If the white flyer was the pigeon, then that's the blue flag on high. Hmm, if that's the boy's father wearing blue clothes, then I wonder. Hmm. Does his father have something to do with the prophecy? I guess I should look for him just in case. He might lead me to the man of my destiny. Okay, I'm glad this is one continuing story instead of like the envelope was like five side quests that all lead to, you know, finding dandelions. So I'm glad about that. Don't you worry, kid. I'll find your dad, okay? You just stay r right here in front of this wall and don't move an inch. Got it? Okay. What the hell is that on the wall? Blue flag on high. This has got to be... Gotta be high, right? Let's go through here and see. Top of the TV tower would be a good place to start, would it? Okay, collecting these gems kind of feels pointless when I can get 300 of them for doing a challenge, but maybe they all add up throughout the game. Oh, it's telling me where to go because I took too long. Thanks. Oh, when you run out, you just drop. You don't. You don't keep your momentum. All right. 600 per challenge? What? Wait, hold on. So you get 100 for bronze and then 200 added to 100 for silver, so 300. And then you get 300 for gold? So you get six. Oh, holy shit. This is the blue flag. It's just a piece of laundry. We'll take it for your for your trash heap house. Well, all right, it's an impressive piece of laundry, but now what? I hope this underwear doesn't belong to that kid's dad. Hmm, well, blue flag or not, I suppose I should keep looking around. Next up are the red runners. Is there anything around here that fits that prophecy? Hmm, what's that noise? Oh my god, something red is running. Red balloons. Hmm, of course, the red runners. Red balloon, red balloon. What's your favorite episode of Peppa Pig, chat? Oh, there's another one. Jason! It's like he was waiting for that balloon to come to come to him. Um, excuse me, that red runner, uh, I mean, red balloon, is that yours? Uh, I'm sure he'll love this. Excuse me, miss, have you seen my son around? I've been looking for him. He went running to explore a tunnel, and then he vanished. Hmm, he is wearing blue. Oh, oh, yes, yes, I know where he is. He asked me to find you, actually. Your son is waiting, f waiting in front of that wall with all the graffiti. I told him to wait there. Thank you. I can't take my eyes off that boy for a second. I'm lucky he ran into you. Oh, of course. I couldn't possibly ignore a crying kid. Come on. I'll take you to him. This guy isn't the man of destiny, is he? 
Uh, hold on, before we go, I need to check something. I found the red runners, so next up is the open gateway. The graffiti on the wall look kind of like a door, so maybe that's it? I guess I better get him back to his son first. Sorry to keep you waiting, let's go. They're gonna open a door when they get there. Spider episode of Peppa Pig was banned in Australia because Peppa said all spiders are our friends. Yeah, th that makes sense. Yeah, they should ban it there. Okay, I'm ready to go. Let's go. Isn't a big part of growing up in Australia is, is being taught never put your hand somewhere that you can't see at first. And if you have to do do it, have a, have a sturdy pair of gloves on. Just like, it's like drilled into you at a young age, like, just in case. He didn't really read the tooltip. I did not read the tooltip, no. What am I supposed to be doing? Do I go get the kid? I think that's fair to, that's fair to say that's true everywhere. I mean, I stick my hands in places I can't see all the time. Carry the dad. Oh. I feel you shouldn't. I mean, like, I I had to plug the PlayStation 5 in behind the desk earlier. And it's not like I, I doubly checked. I was like, I like put my hand back there to, to feel out some stuff before I got the plug in. Like, things like that. In Australia, you might risk getting uh, spidered. What if the mouse was dead? Then I'm going to meet the mouse. So you live your life not sticking your hands places just in case, but you don't own a plunger. All right, where'd the kid go? And that wall with the graffiti. Oh, it was, it was a door. Okay. I don't see him here. Huh? I told him to stay right there. I'll bet he ran off to explore that, th that tunnel again. There's something strange about it. Don't worry, I'll go and find him. Okay, sure. Hmm, now what? Let me check the letter. The open gateway is next, and then the invitation underground. Aha, maybe this is a gateway. Hey, hang on. I'm coming with you. All right, here we go. Excuse me, miss. Pardon me if this seems a bit abrupt, but... Uh-oh. Where is this going? Yes, what is it? Doesn't something seem odd about this tunnel? The air feels different in here, like we're being watched. Hmm. Like father, like son, I guess. Oh, uh, really? It feels normal to me? What? Have you ever wondered where this place came from? Maybe none of this is real. Maybe it's all just an illusion and we're just figments of someone's imagination. <laughs> what? What do we do? Okay, this guy's making zero sense now. Um, you must be getting tired from looking at, for your boy. I'll go on go on ahead and check for him alone, okay? Alright, is it dungeon time? And he's just gonna let us do it. Alright, father of the year. Alright. I know this is sudden. Wait, what? Joe, you said in the Forspoken stream that your name online is actually a made-up name for any online work published. Where, where are you actually joking, or is it actually serious that you used used a fake name? Yeah, I confirmed that like like weeks ago. Yeah, Joseph Anderson is not my real name. Meow, Dusty, where are you going? I can I can't shift gravity without you. Oh, we can't. Oh, this is all that flim flam fortune teller's fault. All this crazy stuff's happening. None of this was in the prophecy. I guess there's still that final part left. But for the time being, I need to worry about catching Dusty. Whoa. Oh, I can't I can't gravity rush. This is the whole point. Joe, have you told us your kids' real names? Yes I have, yeah. Cause there's no way I couldn't like not fuck that up. I'm stunned I haven't fucked up my real name. Probably because, to a certain extent, it is my real name now. Because it's been so long. 
So I have two real names. I have my real real name, and then I have, like, Joseph or Joe. I'm not really fond of the name Joseph. I prefer Joe. Joe's not bad. Joseph is kind of like, eh. Little ostentatious. Hmm, where does this pipe lead? Wait, maybe this is related to the prophecy. Where's that letter? That's right. That's right. The square hole. An, an open gateway followed by an invitation underground. Maybe that pipe is my invitation underground. Underground. I sure hope it is anyway. I've come too far to turn back now. Why did we not have gravity for this part? Is it just so we couldn't shift through it? Oh. That's the scene. How'd you come up with Joseph Anderson anyways? Joseph from Joseph Heller, because Cash 22 is my favorite book, and Joseph Heller wrote it. And Anderson, um, because I've just always used Anderson. Even before I published the, the books, um, I used Anderson as a, as my fake last name since I was like 13. I've always been pretty careful about using my fake name online. Uh, sorry, my real name online. Oof. Yawn. Huh? Oh, you've arrived. I'm the man who's going to change your destiny. Uh, what? I just remembered I have an appointment. Wait. This guy looks familiar. What? I am the creator of this world. He also lives in a sewer. You poor, poor old man being stuck down here all alone must have gotten to you, huh? And as creator, I have a request. Oh, I see. You need help finding your way home? I guess we're in the same boat there. No, that's not... Wait, you need me to open a bottle? Is that it? Childproof caps do not concern... Alright, then I guess listen when a person speaks. So, you're a person now. I thought you said you were the creator. Arg, no, I am the creator. The letter from the fortune teller led me to what I thought was just an eccentric, lonely old man. But I would soon come to discover the truth behind the fortune and how this man could change my destiny. <sighs> huh? How did I end up back here and the tunnel, it's gone again? Does, does Lily or the kids ever call you Joe, either on purpose or accident? No. No one in the house calls me Joe. No one in the house calls me my real name either. They know it, but yeah. <coughs> Meow. Dusty, where were you? Don't run off like that. Meow. Sorry, well, I guess this whole man of destiny thing was just a sham. I should have known better than to listen to a fortune teller. That old, that crazy old man's about as far from my destiny as one can get. Okay, what about the kid though? Missing kid? Meow. Wait, you disagree? Oh, come on. Maybe I should look for that old man. He's a bit strange, but seems to have answers. What about the missing kid? No? We don't care. Alright. Wait, hold on. There's lore. I heard there was lore. Raven just showed up one day back when she was still a child. She was always wandering around searching for her home and her parents. Guess she never found them though. Really? That's so sad. She had trouble take talking to people and eventually gave up trying. I was worried something might happen to her, but it seems she's tougher than I thought. Just when I'd forgotten all about her, she shows up again with that crow and the ability to shift gravity. Hmm. She must have run across that crow whenever wherever she went missing. I wonder where she found it. Maybe she's a secret agent or something. I hear she's been seen talking to government types. Okay. And the other one was like over here, wasn't it? No. Oh, it was. There was one over here.
Have you heard the rumors going around? They say there's a totally different world on the other side of the storms. I hope so. You mean how it gets sunny for a moment during the eye of, of, of a storm? No, that's not what I mean. I mean, there really is a different world, and that's where they say the missing towns went. What, really? The kids that have lost their parents to the storm all keep having the same dream about the other side. That's how the rumor got started in the first place. Okay. What is that pin? Oh, there's a pin? Where's the pin? I don't see a pin. There's no pin. What's your opinion on Ye Miko? Ye Miko these nuts? Well, I don't know what that is. What is that? The pin ran out? Oh, that sucks. Please won't you tell us your real name, Daddy Uwu. Alright, cool. I've offered a couple times and most people in chat say no, so that's how it's going to stay for now. Grumble, have you seen a strange old man running around with a bunch of trash? Um, what? No, I can't say I have. He's always rummaging through everyone's garbage. And is this the old lady we helped earlier? And he doesn't just act crazy, he talks crazy too. He thinks he created the world for crying out loud. All I've seen him create is a mess. Oh, okay. There we go. Alright, what's this? Side mission? The events that followed took place not long after Alias made off with Aldar's sacred gem. My actions to protect the gem earned me the trust of the city's residents, but there was one man who still misunderstood me. That misunderstanding would lead to my brief career working for one of the wealthiest families in Aldnor. Aldnor. Okay, so like, I could come back and do this earlier, and, and this is the context for it, I guess? Pops, I'm so c c cold my nose won't stop running. Is this the kid and the dad? Uh, my poor boy, are you coming down with something? Sigh, I can't even pr provide a home for my family. I'm sorry, Pops. I didn't mean to complain. It's not your fault we lost the house. It's... What? You still blame me for what happened to your house? Oh, I give up. What do you want from me? Money? Yes. So you're finally going to accept some responsibility. I know just the thing. Over at the mansion, they're looking for a new maid. <sighs> the pay is good. A maid? That's not the kind of job that usually pays so well. What's the catch? Well, the husband's a famous writer, and he's always out and about looking for new material to use in his stories, so the wife's well. She gets a little stir-crazy all alone in that big mansion. It's rough on the maids, though, and Melda chews through them like candy. Maid gone you? Why am I being question marked? I sighed exasperatedly, not excitedly. Hmm, if only the husband wasn't out all the time, his wife wouldn't get so worried and scare off the higher top. You're right, I'm a streamer! Hey, us men need our space. We can't help who we are. No, Ajin probably can't help being Ajin. Alright, I'll give it a shot. I'm used to putting up with unreasonable people. You moaned? If I moaned, you would know. That's not- This is really tear. <laughs> Donkey, if it were me! You'd be dead. You know, I almost envy you. That Lady Melda is a real looker. If I was a little younger, I'd apply myself. Pops, why would you want to work for some crazy lady? You'll understand someday, UG. So, Shifter, do we have a deal? Yeah, it's a yeah, it's a deal. It, it'll be nice to finally get these two off my back. Uh, the Diary of a Maid. Maid Pack Part 1. What's the Maid Pack? I better go over to the mansion Ajin was talking about. Alright. Pass the interview. Alright. Pass the interview, bro. Nailed it. Nailed it. Hello, are you Melda, the lady of the house? Yes, what do you want? I don't believe in charity, so if that's your game. Huh? Charity? No, I'm here about the... And those clothes, they look older than you. 
Is that hard? Why are you wasting my time? State your business or leave this instant. Well, uh, it's about the maid opening. Maid, you? Do I look so desperate that I'd hire any old riffraff that comes crawling off the street? Hmm. Well, I need the amusement, so I'll give you a chance. I haven't even started working, I'm all, and I'm ready to quit. You won't be disappointed, madam. I won't hire just any old anybody. You better know a little bit about the city, or you're no, you're no use to me. Pass the simple test, and I'll consider you for the job. All right, here we go. What is the name of this part of the city? Uh, Odnor. What animal is the statue used to hold our, sounds, our town's sacred gem? Uh, a, it's a fish, isn't it? Fish. What is in the statue that stands in the town's fountain? Shit. I don't know. What is the statue that stands in the town's fountain? Uh, a, a boy. Shit. What does he need to fuel city projects? Gems. They're all gems! Sacred gems? Sacred gems. Shit! Really, any vagrant would know more about the city. I refuse to hire, hire someone so useless. Wait. Useless? Useless me? Wait, give me another chance. Let's go again. Hmm, maybe if I ask around town, I'll find answers to Melda's test. Nah, no, it's, it's, it's cool. Nah, no, it's cool. I'll just, no, I'll, I'll just, I'll just take it again. I'll just take it again. I'll take it again. Madam, I'm ready to give the interview another go. You finally, you really don't want to give up. Finally, give you another chance. All right. Uh, all, all nor. Uh, uh, fish. Um, okay. So boy, cat, crow, boy, frog, turtle, boy, frog, fish. It's boy, frog, fish. Shit. E uh, energy gems. Do you realize the useless meme is still going seven years later? Has it been seven years? It hasn't been seven years. Alright. Odd nor. Uh it's a fish, right? Fish. Boy boy frog fish. What? All right, it's got to be precious gems. All right, we did it. All right. Really, any vagrant would Okay, fucking hell. We need we need all of them, right? It's boy cat crow, really? That's the same you clicked last time. No, it's not. I got one more right this time, didn't I? It's boy, frog, turtle. Oh, did I do the right one? Sorry, the wrong one again? My bad. Oh, uh, it's fish. All right, so chat says boy, frog, turtle. Oh, you're right. Okay, and what is it? Precious gems. Precious gems. All right, we did it. All right, now we can be a maid. We made it. Thank you, Zargi, for the resub, and thank you to Prime Guy also for the resub with Prime. Hmm. Well, at least you know something. It goes against my better judgment, but you're hired. Thank you, madam. I'll do anything, I promise. Anything? Hold on just one second. You're not working for me in those rags. I expect you to arrive on time and properly dressed. Maid costume acquired. Okay, she looks cute in the portrait. She looks cute in the portrait. Well, now at least you look the part. You should burn those awful things you were wearing. I agree. Thank you, madam. Did my clothes really look that bad? Yes. You have a wonderful house. I heard your, your husband's a famous writer. Is he here today? No, he's not here. He's never here. And even if he was here, he would be locked away in his study. I might as well be married to a ghost. I met a ghost. I see. Your husband sounds very busy. Don't you get lonely in this big house? And don't you get tired of prying into other people's affairs? Oh, I don't pay you for ask questions. I pay you to work. True. Out front, you'll find some knickknacks I grew tired of. Take them around back so the garbage people can haul them away. And don't lollygag. lollygag. I hate lollygaggers. No lollygagging. All right, I'm going to take this back to my trash pad. Oh, this is all for me. 
Yes, I mean, no, I won't lollygag. Why didn't she just dump that stuff out back in the first place? I'm going to take all this home. Move the junk in time. What do you mean, in time? To where? Where's it going? Out back. I'm confused. Where's it going? This is the front, right? So it's behind. Alright. It's gotta be back here, right? Up there. Alright. No, drop. Drop. Okay. One at a time, really? Can we, can we upgrade the power? No, we can't. Okay, I unironically prefer this outfit to the other one. Unironically, I think she looks better. Is that... Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Freak Char I think this is a more normal outfit than what she was wearing. I don't I don't think it's it's a bad thing. Oh, new paintings for our our, uh, our sewer. It's going to be close. It's going to be close. Oh. Oh. Alright, we did it. Well, that's done. Now I need you to bring me something sweet. I get, I can get cranky without my sweets. I'm sure. What do you want me to bring you? The Mel the Special Sunday is my own concoction. A mountain of vanilla ice cream topped by a gourmet cookie smothered in rich jam. Ugh, and sprinkled with flakes of bitter chocolate. You better bring me exactly what I want. No mistakes. Shit. Mountain of vanilla ice cream, gourmet cookie, rich jam, bitter chocolate flakes. Already placed the order with the thin, with the ice cream stand over by the drawbridge. It'll be in a special box. Make sure the gourmet cookie is mint chocolate. Oh, now you're adding to the order! Oh, no, like Jan with a stand with a guard dog. What? What? Okay, Jan with a stand with a guard dog. Mint co Oh, fucking hell. And the bitter chocolate has to be this color. The bitter ch chocolate flakes must be the highest quality. They need to come from the store that always has the young woman lined out the door. Now, Scoot, if you let my ice cream sundae melt, you better not come back at all. What the fuck? My ice cream, a cookie, jam, and chocolate. Your wish is my command, madam. Excuse me, I'm here to pick up an order for, for Melda. Your new help, huh? All right, got the order right here in the special box. All right, we got the special box. That's a huge amount of ice cream, what the fuck? All right, we're picking it up. Now for the ice cream, now for the cookie. All right, where's the cookie? Where do I get the cookie? What the fuck are you talking about? Where, 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 where how, I thought they were all gonna be in the line. I have to go searching for the cookie. It's over there. All right, here we go, find the cookie. All right, cookie, mint, 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 mint cookie. Excuse me, can I get a cookie? Yeah, uh-huh, 
Sure, which one of our four famous cookies would you like? The mint one. The mint one. Mint. Meat. The meat cookie. Mint cookie. All right. Thank you so much. I'm I'm the best maid. All right. Here we go. Now for the jam. Jam was with the dog. All right. Where are we going? All right. Dog. All right, which which one's the right one? The one with the dog outside. All right, I don't see a dog. I don't see a dog. I, I see a dog. All right, here we go. Yes. I'm gonna need some jam. All right, here's the jam. All right, good luck. All right, we did it. We did it. Now we have to go for the chocolate flakes that come from the the girls lined outside. Oh sh! Okay, let's go. Wait, hold on. Is it is it below? Oh damn, the ice cream! Shit, we have to go even lower, beyond. What? How is it down there? All right, girls lined up. Okay, those are the those are the, the those are guys. It was young girls, wasn't it? Those are just that's just like children and parents. This one, yeah, line up here. All right, all right, all young girls lined up here. This must be the place. All right, here we go. Excuse me, gonna get some chocolate. Good thing the line cleared in three seconds. You're in the right place. Best chocolate in all of Aldnor. Only the sweetest sweet and the bitter bitterest bitter here. A golden ingredients for melted Sunday. Now I just gotta get it back there before it melts. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. We did it. We did it. We did it. First try. First try. Legit first try. Okay, movement system's actually pretty fun. All right, we did it. I brought you the Melda su special Sunday, madam. Ah! Uh-oh, what did we come home to? Oh, huh, madam, are you okay? Please, you gotta help me. I opened a window to air out my husband's study and five pages of his latest manuscript went flying right out of it. I can't let him fall into the wrong hands. But I just got back. What do you want me to do with the Sunday? Who can eat ice cream at a time like this? It's the latest issue of my husband's Gerui cereal. You have to get it back. Oh, is it about a blonde? Yes, madam. If she doesn't want the ice cream, I'll take it. All right. Merrick, you do those, don't you? All right, where are we going? Find the missing pages. Maybe Merrick left, actually. I don't know. Okay. Pages should be around here somewhere. I would like an objective marker, please. Objective marker, please. There's no objective marker. All right. I have to go around. Oh, no, it's right here. All right, we got one. All right, pick it up. Oh, we're a menace. One of the missing pages. I better read it and make sure. The dark tendrils of death began to slither into the recesses of Giriri's mind. She was slipping away from the world, watching long lost memories dance in her consciousness. Well, I wonder who this is about. The wheel of fate was being turned by the hand of the soothsayer, the same wrinkled hag who started the journey with those faith fateful words. The Legendary Adventures of Guriri and the Queen of the Lost Civilization's Missing Memories, Issue 310, Chapter 1, Page 101. Oh. Great. I know what this is. Wow, that title's a mouthful. I don't understand what's going on, but whatever it is, it must be popular enough to keep going for over 300 issues. No, not necessarily. It has five fans. Alright, where's, where's the rest of them? Found on the page. Wait, something seems different. The sun was high and all the neighbors were away as she waited for the daily knock on the door. I could hardly finish the first knock when she came flying out the door and jumped all over me. I responded more vigorously than ever while she responded with, Responded with what? And what the heck is this? This doesn't sound like the same story. What kind of stuff are kids reading nowadays? Well, I better find the rest of the manuscript. The next page in the legendary ventures of something something. I can't follow the story anyway, so I'll skip reading this one. Thank you. Kind of hard to start this late in the series. Who has the time to read that many issues? Yeah, it's true. That's true. It's pretty true. It's pretty true. It's really true, actually. Super true. Truing. I didn't pick up the paper. 
It didn't let me pick up the paper. Why am I only a two of five? What? Didn't I get three? Oh, was one of them not it? Another page. Wait, is a number. I better check it. Feeling clean after her hot, steamy bath, she looked up into my eyes with satisfaction. I saw a thin trail of drool dribbling down her chin. I agree with the cat. Don't give me that look. I'm not actually interested in this stuff, Baka. I just had to check to make sure it was in the right manuscript. Speaking of which, I better hurry up and find the other pages. This is the third page. I'd recognize that long title anywhere. Giriri sure seems stuck in this flashback. Oh, so some of the pages are other things. Is the story ever going to come back to the present? Then the writing style is so weird too. I can barely keep track of what's going on. Okay. Oh, it's the fourth missing page. And that's a good thing because that's what I'm looking for. What is this making fun of? Me. It's making fun of me. Okay, what am I what am I supposed to be doing? I can't lift it up. Kick it? Kicking it isn't working either. Oh, I have to do a special kick. Yes, it's next page of the other story. I better look over just to be sure. She licked my face, seeking me out like a hungry beast. So beautiful, covered in a thick coat of hair like a... A what? She shook her tail in anticipation. You know what? This could still go either way. Wait, tail? When I saved that poor stray dog from the streets, I might have saved her life. But in the end, she saved mine. Could still go either way. That whole thing was about a dog? I mean, of course it was just about a dog. It's still unclear to me. Now, I better find the last page of the missing manuscript for Melda. Hey, why can't you be more friendly like that dog in the other story? Yeah, do dog's way better than cat. Okay. Okay, so so far, chat, this quest sucks. Just putting it out there. Was this a DLC quest? They add they added this to the game afterwards? Oh man, imagine downloading that that day. I guess you'd be happy because it's like you get the maid costume. But why didn't they make you do all this shit before you get the maid costume? Or is it do you have to do this shit to unlock it permanently? Is that what's going on? Because if so, well played to them. I'm not seeing the last one. Is it up up here somewhere? Here we go, it's the fifth and final missing page in the Gruyere story. Wait, now the Soothsayer is having a flashback. Does this thing ever move forward? Who cares about some old hag? What about Gruyere? And who's this new character being introduced? It would take a magician to wrap this up. Oh well, someone must be enjoying it if the author can afford a big mansion like that. I better get these back to Melda. The Legend of Melda. That's all of them. God, imagine paying money for this DLC. I mean, people spend way more money on a costume in Genshin, and it doesn't even come with a fucking quest. Madam, I found all five of these missing pages of your husband's latest career story. Well, your performance today was tolerable. I suppose you expect to get paid here. Wow, look at all this money. I can pay Ajin, Ajin ba with some despair. Thank you, madam. I'm expecting big things from you. I may not be the easiest woman to work with, but I appreciate your effort. She can be nice. I won't let you down, madam. Wait, is there is there more of this? My first payday, but I don't get to keep any of it. But I guess a promise is a promise. What do you mean? I thought you said there was going to be some to spare.
That little girl's crying. I wonder what happened. Hey, what's wrong? Why are you crying? I dropped the money I need for mommy's medicine. She's real sick and it's all my fault. She won't get better. Wait, I've got some money. Here, take it. You need it more than I do. Really? You do that for me? Thank you, miss. Oh, we just got scammed. We just got hardcore scammed. Did we give her all our money? Hey, Gatsby. Oi, I'm guessing by that outfit you got the job. How much money did you pull down today? Well, I got the job and I put in a good day's work, but there was a girl and she was crying, so... What? You gave her the money? What about us? Yeah, what about us? You like giving money to sad little kids? How about I start crying for you? Sniff, sniff. Oh, for the love of... Who I help with my hard-earned money is my business. Here's an idea. Why don't you two get a job? Yeah! Have you tried getting a job? My first day as a maid was over. Melda was a tough mistress, and the job wasn't easy, but the feeling of accomplishment when I held that first paycheck in my hand was undeniable. Who would have guessed that my new job and my association with Melda would drop me right in the middle of a scandal? But that's another story for the time. What? Where is this going? What is this game? What are you making me play? Why are we not a maid anymore? Maximum power has increased. Maybe I should look for the old man. He's a bit strange. Seems to have answered. What do you mean our maximum power has increased? What? Doing the maid quest increased our max level. It's it's not a story thing. Doing the maid quest. What? So it's like it's like a reputation thing? Like the, as you do quests, that's it? All right. Amazing, amazing. Nice shot. Your reputation is a problem solver. Oh, so th this is the whole game. This isn't just like a, a slice of life intro. Like m most of the game is just gonna be bullshit around the city. Oh, okay, that's, okay, all right, cool, all right. This is the most anime we've get. Nah, Xenoblade Chronicles 2 was worse. Like coffee with milk. Rex and Pyra. Well, that was easy. No! To be honest, show PS Vita was on par with the Nintendo 3DS, so it actually kind of, so it's actually kind of sick game since this version only textures and resolution is upscaled. Oh, is it really? Okay, that makes that makes the visuals a bit more palatable. Yeah. What's this? Oh, it's this one. Do you think we can do it better now? I don't think we can. We we haven't upgraded any of our uh, combat moves. So what has been your lasting impression of Deadly Premonition? Definitely memorable out of 10. I don't know what else to say. I'd like to go, I'd like to go to the sewer hideout. I want to go home. I want to go home. Can I go home? I think we did it. There we go. Alright, can we... Yes! Alright, here we go! Alright, welcome to how she's gonna look for the rest of the game.
All right. If we've already done a challenge mission, will it show on the map here that we did it already? Yeah, completed. All right, that's nice. That's nice that they, they did that. All right, so we did we did all of them around here. What's what's this one here? Save point, challenge mission. Oh, here's one we haven't done. All right. Would you still wear the maid outfit if she had cat or bunny ears? If she had bunny ears, I would wear it even more. If she had cat ears, I would probably take it off. Oh, doesn't her hair look better? It's tied up in a ponytail. It's just a, an improvement in every area. Herbal Space Program Fridays on Saturdays after First Spoken. Now, we're going to play Atomic Heart after First Spoken. I wouldn't mind trying Kerbal Space Program once and see if I like it. Why do we have to fix something in order to unlock the mission? It's weird. Oh, it's another combat one. Shit. Well, let's, let's do it. At least we probably get bronze, at least. Wait, why can't I? Why? 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 Why can't I? Okay, tutorial available. Throwing objects. Press circle to grab an object like a stasis field, and then press circle again to throw an object to the directional marker. Okay. I can't slide either? Well, this sucks. Okay, I don't like this. This is really awkward. Skill issue me if you wish, but it's really awkward. You need you need to come down or else I can't hit you though. Alright, I'm leaving. Okay, why aren't you grabbing anything? Why, we're right next to something. Why won't you grab it? Okay, why won't you throw it? Why won't you throw it? Okay, now it works somehow. Okay, I don't know why I did wrong there, but okay. We got bronze. All right, cool. How often do you wash your bathroom floor mat? We don't have one. Okay, let's try again. Maybe I'm pressing the throw button too soon. Now that I know what to do.
What? Alright. I don't get it. It's really awkward. Oh, what's that? Gem? This guy better be worth a lot of points. Like, just, just a shit ton of points. Now it's used. Okay, cool. Okay, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Alright, he's back. Alright, we got him. Alright, he's worth 100 points. That was not worth it. Do, 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 do. New record. New record. Alright, let's retry and let's skip him. I don't understand what happened there. I understand that I was hitting them when I was trying to throw it at the beginning because I want to see if that would work, but I don't understand what happened every single other time after that. Who's the worst protagonist you ever played in the game? Oh, that's a hard question. Rex is definitely up there. Frey is up there too. Frey's awful. The one of the Life is Strange games. Who's Frey? Frey is the... For fuck's sake! Frey is the protagonist of Forspoken. And she's really bad. Floats is like, oh yeah, you have us, don't worry, and then you just don't have it, let my O. The Atomic Heart Protag will be worse. Worse than Frey? Come on. I'm gonna die. I have died. Game over. Alright, I don't like this. I'll come back later when I have it um, powered up. This sucks.
Um, where now? Side mission. What's what's the side mission? Oh great, more of this bullshit. Time for egg delivery! The events that followed took place after I was accepted as a maid into Melda's service. I was still penniless, but excuses wouldn't be wouldn't put a roof over Ajin and Yuji's head. I thought it would be easier to earn the money they needed than to try to convince them the house incident wasn't my fault. So I headed to Melda's mansion and ran and right into trouble. Just gravity rushed the hell out of there. Why aren't we in and dressed in our maid outfit? Wait, wasn't that the police? What were they doing outside the mansion? Well, I better hurry up. I hate to be late on my second day. Boy, Shifta! Oh no. Hey, I need to talk to you. What? Is it about your house again? I don't have time for this. I need to get to work. No, it's about, it's not about the house. It's Well, it's about Melda. Did you hear? She's dead. Hear what? I just found out. But her husband vanished. She filed a, mis a missing person report. What? Really? Is that what the police were here about? The police? I guess the rumors are true. She really off the old guy. Oh, she's a... S are we going to be a maid detective now? Oh, she's a smart one. Filing a report to make it look like she's worried. Whenever those two were together, they were always fighting. I guess she finally had enough. What? You think she killed her husband? She might be a little rough around the edges, but she's no killer. She was even starting to be nice to me. She's really sweet when she gets to know her, I think. Well, rumors are just rumors. Without proof, she's the only one who knows she killed her husband. Just figured I'd warn you. I don't need warning. Melda won't hurt any, wouldn't hurt anyone. I know this after having, hanging out with her for one day. Anyway, I need to get to work. I still have to change into my uniform. Meow. Change out, then back in. Oh, we get to see this again. Great. <laughs> We're approaching Haru levels of forehead here, by the way. Good morning, madam. It's me, Kat, and I'm ready to work. Sigh. Fine, fine. Get to work, then. I'm in a bad mood. Huh? She's even grumpier than usual today. I'm sorry to hear that, madam. Can I get you something to drink? A drink? Do I look like I need a drink? I need to go. Get out of my way. But what am I supposed to do while you're gone? I'm sorry, madam. You must have a lot on your mind with your husband. And what do you know about my husband? I see that. You think I did it too? Oh, just go home. Okay. Can I get paid, please? Huh? I didn't... Uh, leave. I'll manage on my own. I don't need anyone. What did I do? E yes, madam. I'll be leaving then. In my maid suit. I guess I get the day off. Something about this is bugging me, though. Alright, time to solve the mystery. The Madam and the Shifter. <laughs> Melda's angry, even for Melda. Hey, where's she going? She's not going to be happy if she spots me. I mean, I'm getting the feeling that if, if like, we were in some small town and the audio was mixed differently and it had more surreal vibes, that this would be a cult classic. It has all the markings of it. Cat needs to talk about bad movies more. Where are we going? Yo, do you like Forzen? I don't like Forzen, but I don't dislike him either. I don't know anything about Forzen, really. I should back off a little. Oh, is she right there? You, are you following me? You're fired. You're fired. Oh, I see now. Okay. Hold on. Wait, what the fuck just happened to her skirt? Um. You, are you following me? You're fu She looks like a goddamn jellyfish. She has leggings on. She has like yoga pants on. Even if she wasn't wearing the 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 skirt, it would just be normal clothes. There was nothing wrong with that. I just want to know why her fucking skirt went up like a fucking jellyfish trying to move. The sh movement. She stopped. What's she doing? Stop. 
Step away from the ledge. Okay, there's no way that, that the game wanted me to tail her for like five seconds and now I have to go up to her, right? Like, there's no way the game would do that, right? Did she just throw something over the edge? I should back off a little. I should back off. I, I mean, I'm behind a wall. She can't see me. Who's making the ice cream in the city? How do you guys have ice cream? Where are the cows? Where's the ice? Assassin's Creed has done irreparable damage to video games. all that about is she happy the husband's gone maybe she did do it melda hailed a cab oh oh that's how you hail a cab in this world where's she going now okay that looks like melda hey you are you the new maid at melda's place why is she so interested yes that's me can i help you my niece worked for that witch got worked to the bone and then fired for her trouble melda came into the world mean and she'll leave it mean well, she can be a little difficult sometimes. I wouldn't know anything about that. Hmph. Heard her husband got tired of that attitude and gave her a piece of his mind. I'll bet that's why she whacked him. What? Well, you shouldn't believe everything you hear. She wouldn't do that, I don't think. I know someone who saw her coming out of that fishy two-bit fortune teller's place. Wonder what that was all about. She probably left to, to go cover up the evidence before the police got to it. What a woman. Hiring, hiding evidence? Meeting fortune tellers? Really, she's not like that. Follow the cab. But not, but not too closely though, right? But not like, but not like too closely. Maybe, yeah, yeah, yeah. They should back off a little. She, how did she notice me? She's like peering out the window like a fucking hawk right now. I. St She's gonna meet Alias. Is she looking for something? They say the killer always returns to the scene of the crime. You there! Uh, yes? What are you doing down there? What am I doing? Oh, well, I was just, uh, taking a stroll. 
Wait, aren't you the Gravity Queen? What? You know, Gravity Queen? When did that happen? You know, we could really use your help. Someone in the area reported hearing yelling. Yelling? Where was it coming from? What's Gravity Queen? Right around here somewhere, but I haven't heard anything myself. Maybe it was a prank call. Spoilers? Mm, a man yelling. Melda left. Oh man, she's melding. What's this, a letter? It's addressed to the madam from One Pandora's Fortunes. It's kind of hard to read the writing. Is it a bill? Maybe the key to solving this case is in the letter. I know I shouldn't open other people's mail, but this is a matter of life or death. A shining blade twinkling in the void, soar on the ground like an eagle. Hands are as feet while you listen to the earth. Go to the root within. Go to the root with the secret. Are these instructions from the fortune teller? The first three items are crossed out. That just leaves the fourth. Go to the root with the secret. If I want to get to the bottom of this, I have to find that secret Ford Melda does. Meow. Check around the trees. I mean, there are thousands of trees. Thousands. So many trees. Which tree? All right. I actually am going to have to go from tree to tree. All right. Nothing here. Nothing here. Nothing here. <laughs> Nothing here. Nothing here. Maybe I'll find some of the roots of these trees. Nope, nothing here. Nothing here. Alright, I think we're looping trees now. What was that noise? Oh, it's a gravity gauge. Okay, cool. It's gonna be down here somewhere. Down here. I feel it. My gamer sense is tingling. It's down here. I have never been more wrong. I have never been more wrong. The roots are on the underside, maybe. Yeah, that's where I was gonna go next. But like, it's it's giving me like um, like feedback when I go next to the trees up here. Oh, maybe it's that tree. That tree looks suspicious. Hey, this is the part of the husband's manuscript. Maybe this was the secret the fortune teller wanted Melda to bury. I wonder what it says. She never understands me. Maybe she's better off without me. I saw her standing there one day, hovering over my bed, watching me sleep with that cold stare and that knife glittering in her hand. Wait, this is a manuscript? It's, her, it's his diary. She did do it, didn't she? Uh oh. Oh no, gravity rush and get it. You can fly. Bitch, you can fly! The evidence is flying away. Oh, we're gonna fly and get it. That's for us to do. Okay. The husband? He's the man from the painting in Melda's mansion. That's the suit, that beard. It's him, Melda's husband. He's alive and I found him. Uh-oh. Nevi. Uh. He's gone, and I was so close that Nevi must have got him. Oh, he's dead. All right, well, that sucked. I won't let them get away with this. What do you mean? Oh man, holy shit. Alright, so if I have a red circle, I'm gonna get him. Alright, so red circle. Red circle, okay. Upgrade gravity kick so it one shots. Do you think I'm made of vitality gems?
Oh, I thought it was on him. What? How are you looking at the game so far? It's pretty good. It's kind of all over the place, but uh, I'm enjoying it. Okay, I don't always have to have the red circle though. Sometimes I can just get it. I just been a little faster. Could have saved Melva's husband. Oh, did he really die? Huh? What was that? What's going on? He's not dead, is he? Um, excuse me. Oh, thank heavens! I was trying to get your attention when those monsters showed up, and I slipped and fell down here. You're Melva's husband, right? You're not a ghost, are you? Aren't you? Aren't you aren't you here with my rescue party wait i recognize the uniform did Melda send you to find me he doesn't sound like a ghost let me just cut to the chase did you run away from melda because she was trying to kill you all are all the things you wrote true oh that old thing i was just branching out figured i'd try my hand at a suspense novel wait you thought my wife tried to that's tea let's see thank you hot tea no of course not she has been acting kind of funny going all the way going all over town doing weird things well whatever it is you're thinking you got it all wrong i just came down here looking for inspiration but well i couldn't get back up maybe we should take this talk topside i'm a little nervous after that last fall i still don't get why melda was acting so funny all right let's go all right let me carry you up with the circle button oh, darling i thought i'd never see you again ho ho The police, they think I killed you? Oh, it's just like the fortune teller said you were right here waiting for me. Melda, I'm so sorry to worry you. You came all the way out here looking for me? The police weren't going to do anything. They thought you ran away from me. I didn't know what to do, so I tried the fortune teller. So, was all that funny business because of a fortune? I let my writing become more, more important... I let my become the most important thing in my life, but nothing's more important than you. I'll never worry you again. I promise from today, I'll treat every moment together like it was our last. Let's travel the world, just the two of us. I mean, like there's one city, bro. What do you mean? What world? What about the mansion? I thought you didn't want to leave, it th leave the family. What family? What's the point in, in living a trapped life? It's time to sell it and live our lives the way we want to live them, Elda. I love you. From now on, it'll just be the two of us. It's the start of a new life and our maid. I don't understand, does she just not have object permanence when something is out of sight? Yeah, maybe she doesn't. Yeah. Anime girls don't really have object per permanence. Yeah, that's pretty true. Yep. Just like weebs can't hear whispering. That's the first time I've ever seen her happy. I should have known she wouldn't kill her husband. That's what I get for listening to rumors. Wait, if they sell the mansion, what happens to my job? Does this mean I'm fired? Meow. Alright guys, how should we fuck with the weebs? About 13 centiles the most. They can't hear this right now. Respond in code. Should we do the... Should we do Resident Evil 4? What? I don't know what to do. How, how far do we delay it?
Sorry, I was having some tea there. Having some tea. I was starting to believe the scandalous rumors about Melda. Then I found her missing husband and reunited the couple. They agreed on the spot to embark on a new journey together. Together. I wish them the best. They still had a problem. I was out of a job, but that wouldn't last long. My next job, well, that's another, that's another story for another time. They didn't pay us. We didn't get paid. My reputation seems to be improving. Cats ma That gave us new power too? Maybe I should look for the old man. He's a bit strange. He seems to have answers. What? Really? I didn't get any XP gems for that too. Gauge usage. Wild red-eyed girl. Alright, now I have to go back and fucking change back into the maid costume again. Oh, so she's stupid. That's a plus in my books. I don't know about you. Um. So, I guess I'm a little sexist. I like my men to be stupid, but I like my women to be smart. <laughs> Definitely a fan of the himbo, for sure. Jorama Carlos, exactly, yeah. Like himbo, dislike a bimbo? I mean... Yeah, I don't- I don't think I like a bimbo... ...outside of a certain context. Yeah. Let's go back. Do we get a house in every single part of the the um, the city? Certain context part? No, not porn. She's looking in the mirror that she found in the dumpster. That's nice. What are all these bottles? Why does she have so many bottles? What are you drinking? Then, then what? Well, I don't know how to say this without without being impolite, but I kind of like the like the aesthetic of a bimbo. In some cases, not all the time, but some cases, but I don't like the attitude of one. Does that make sense? Why did you have to ask? Alright, where are we going? Got it at the wrong time. Time to leave. Yeah, sorry. I just don't want to give people the wrong impression. Where are we going? So Carlos was perfect. Hot fireman, but naive and kind of dumb. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Carlos, Kiru, Kronk from Emperor's New Groove. I have a type for sure. Alright, where are we going? I feel like we've done all the side quests here now. We saved it. Warp manhole. So now we're going to the next location. We're really bad at that challenge mission, so we need some more points to do that one. Alright, let's go to the next mission. Alright, we're done. Begin the mission. Oh, he's here! Okay. Is Yusuke a himbo? I don't think so, no. Yusuke is kind of dumb, though. Yusuke is kind of subtly dumb. 
Yusuke presents himself as a very, like, intelligent person. And then as you peel back those layers, you realize, no, this guy's a fucking idiot. But I don't think he qualifies as a himbo. Hey, old man, what's everyone staring at? The universe ripped their families and homes away. Well, why'd you let it happen, creator? They're all waiting f for the day the universe gives back, back what it has taken from them. Is that they coming? No. That depends on you. The door to a new world is about to open. Beyond it lies the truth about your power. I don't get it. What door? It's a literal door. Will you help them? I would if I could, but how do I know where their families are? It is time. What? What the? <laughs> come, come with me to another world. A whole new world. Wait, you're just, you're just going with it. We're just doing it. We. Okay, so do you know how do you know how himbos are not the direct like parallel of bimbo? Like himbo is just a fun word to say, but himbos and bimbos are very different, right? Right? I I kind of feel like she's the girl version of a himbo. <laughs> But she's not a bimbo. Do you understand what I'm saying? <laughs> and I don't. What? What is she like? What the... <laughs> she's just an idiot. Himbo is just good-natured, stupid. Yeah, that's what I mean. She's good-natured, stupid. So, but she's not a bimbo. What is she? <laughs> the lost city. All right, where are we going? What is this place? This is the world beyond. The missing people are trapped here along with their town. Or oh, do we restore parts of the town? She's a herbo? She's a herbivore? You. Hey, where are you? This world and yours are kept apart for good reason, but someone has brought the two together. You must enter into this world and restore that which is taken. You use a lot of someone and some things when you speak. If you want to be vague, that's fine, but keep it simple. <laughs> Very well then. Follow the flowers to find the missing part of town. How's that? Follow the flowers. Got it. Thank you. Fear not. A good. Whoa! What happened to your eyes? A good creator never gives the worthy an impossible challenge. I have faith in you. Wait. Don't leave me here. If you're such a good creator, why don't you just save the, the town yourself? Don't run away when I'm talking, old man. Ditz is much closer than Bimbo. I'll agree. Yeah, Ditz. I feel like Ditz has too much of a negative connotation to it, though. Like, I feel no no negative connotation when I say Himbo. But I feel a little bit of negativity when I, when I say dits. But maybe I'm wrong. Is is dits is dits a fine thing to say? When I hear dits, I, I I think kind of floozy at the same time. Like dits to me is kind of um a. Uh, Not necessarily clumsy, but could be clumsy. Kind of, kind of an airhead. Kind of very superficial kind of person. Floozy is the one who's normally dry. Is it really? Oh, I'm, I've been misusing Floozy then. The flower bloomed. Alright. When all the Nevi in the area have been defeated, the flowers in the rift plane will bloom to show the way forward. Follow their light to bring back the missing part of town. Okay.
Is combat better than the second one? Combat's better than the second one? That's good. So you can understand the meaning behind the flowers. Hey, where's the missing part of town already? It awaits beyond. Uh, you must first rise and meet the challenge to save its people. Don't forget that the flowers lead the way. And my name is not Hey, it's Gade the Creator. Gade. Okay, right, right. Hey, I better get going. Thanks for the help. Can I run all those? over there anyone else thinks when she goes into this mode she kind of looks like bomb chan Bomb Chan lives on. Bomb Chan from what? From the Choosy Chan collection of the Joseph Anderson Jachinkas. The Jachinka collection. Question, question mark. Yeah, I don't know what I just said either. I just remembered that word. I think Sistorin said it. In in a uh, in a comic, she's from Slay but yeah, she's from Slay the Spire, yeah. I think Merrick said it in a webcomic too. I did in the bomb chain comic during the voting. Yeah, that that, that was it. It, it. Wasn't it one of the the fake political ones with the guy is always in the in the corner? Or maybe it was around that time. Yeah, maybe that's why I have the connection in my head. You mean Gajinka, right? Yeah, isn't that what I said? Sounds bad when you say, because I'm a normie and also over the age of 30, that's why. Sorry. Do you not want me to kiss you goodbye when we get to school anymore either? Just don't even get out of the car. Okay, cool, thanks. Gravity slide. Alright, we know how to do this already. Ooh, that was a lot of power up there. Joe, that's gonna be your kid someday. Yeah, don't I know it? Yeah, I know. Makes me sad. R in the, oh. Wait, in the air. Oh, you can do it in the air too. All right, that's kind of cool.
can use it as a, a momentum adjust too. Oh, we missed a bunch with the tasty crunch. How many are these? Oh, it's even more than 10. Holy crap. What's this down here? Oh, is this the way? Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Whoa, I feel somehow stronger. Special attack, Spiraling Claw. Well, with the Spiraling Claw, you can spin dive toward the center of the screen and tear enemies to pieces. The red signal in the center of the gravity gauge charges up over time. Once it's charged, press triangle to use it. Okay. Pull my devil trigger. Do, 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 do. All right, where do, okay, I can go there, but I feel like I missed something up there. It's telling me to go back there. What's over here? Lots of secrets. Uh, I don't get it. Do I come back here later? Oh, neat. <gasps> Who the hell are you? Perhaps your being able to see me is a result of our respective space-time dimensions overlapping, in which case the possibilities are truly limitless. Oh, it's this guy again. Sing Lore, I was worried I wouldn't see you again. I was hoping we would never see him again ever and it would never address it. What? I haven't been gone anywhere. We've been talking this whole time. Huh? But you disappeared until I, just, I found you again just now. Hmm. If what you say is true, then the variance between our respective timelines is causing me to perceive this as one conversation. Does that mean I, ha I have more time than you? Well, theoretically, you could jump back and forth between our dimensions. That might be the Kase, but since you can't, it's just an issue of perception. In theory, you could suddenly disappear again, and... And there he goes. I wonder if he thinks he's still talking to me. Later, boy. Hmm. I don't know what the hell that is. Oh, did we come from there, or...? You know what, let's go back up. Yeah, boy! Sorry. What is this Metroid music? Man, can you imagine if we streamed all the Metroid Prime games? That would be so boring. Did I miss any orbs? 
doesn't look like it. Not that it really matters. Are there orbs on the other side of this thing? No. What is going on with the skirt? Look at this shit! I mean, you streamed all the Half-Life games, you'll find a way to make it entertaining. Were the Half-Life games that entertaining, though? I feel like Half-Life 2 was, was a good time because of, you know, you know who. But once she was gone, it was like, eh, I don't know. The Half-Life, the Episode 2 stream was not bad, I guess. Black Mesa was fun. This stream has been a bit low energy so far, sorry. Like, but it's not the game's fault, it's me. I'm really tired today. I didn't get much sleep at all. I got on a really bad schedule on the weekend, and then um, I tried my absolute hardest to uh, to go to sleep uh, at a good time yesterday relative to like what was possible. So I went to bed like hours and hours earlier than I normally would have trying to reset my schedule. And um, it worked, I fell asleep, and then like, Five minutes after I fell asleep, Mila had a nightmare and woke me up, so I got up and helped her with that, and then I fell back to sleep somewhat soon after that, but, you know, like, disturbed sleep is not great sleep. She was fine, though. Troy Chan was honestly one of your best stream moments ever. I agree, actually, yeah. I thought, I thought it was a really good, good time. It wasn't that popular, though, but who cares? I had fun. And the people who work here seem to have uh, seen that fun too. I think you have a unique ability to make pretty much everything fun. Either you love it and we can enjoy your analysis or you hate it when you have fun with your reaction or it's a weave game and we can have both. I think because I can engage with chat, it, we usually have a good time. And also I'm, I think it's very easy for me to entertain myself, but that's also because I'm easily bored. So I will like go out of my way to try and do things, but sometimes it backfires and we end up spending way too much time on, on bullshit. But normally it works out. Is that the missing part of town? He was right, the flower showed the way. Very good, you've arrived at last. The master of the rift plane lies ahead. To govern this plane, you must master the master. In other words, I have to take it down? You're catching on. By the way, this is not the only missing area. There are two more out there. Two more? They lie in other rift planes, but you must conquer this one before you can conquer the others. I think it's time to finish up here. Okay. So it's a, it's boss time? I promise you won't be bored for one moment while we play Yeek for Christmas this December. Are, are we doing that? Did I promise? Yeek miss? We wish you a merry yeek miss. We wish you a merry yeek miss. You did. I don't remember promising. I don't remember. Pro I promised. I said we might do it, but I don't remember promising. I can promise right now, though. I promise. I promise. I promise. This year we're gonna have a merry yeek miss. There you go. Done. It's a promise. And you know what? We're gonna make 13 Sentinels pay for it. Me and uh, me and Weeaboo Bill played a little bit of Dark Tide on the weekend. I think we did like um, I think we did a couple missions in it. 
um, and I was telling him about what's next on the stream docket, and I said Gravity Rush, and he was like, yeah! he, like he really likes Gravity Rush, and he was like, I think I think you're gonna like it, and I was like, okay, and then I said 13 Sentinels, and he was like, yeah! he was like even even bigger yes, but he, but he was like like look, I like like. I, I, I'm pretty confident that you're that you're probably gonna like you know some of the movement mechanics in Gravity Rush, but I don't know if you're gonna like 13 Sentinels. <laughs> and I was like, okay, yeah, fair. <laughs> He's like, I really like I really like 13 Sentinels, <laughs> but I don't know if you are. And we spoke about Warhammer for a bit. I think, do you think Finn, Finn's almost eight. Any any Warhammer heads in the chat? He also told me that Warhammer Fantasy got like like nuked and now it's like Age of Sigmar or whatever. I was really surprised. I didn't realize there was such a huge shakeup in, in, uh, in the Warhammer um, area. Do you think Finn, who's gonna be eight in August, is that is that old enough to like do some painting miniatures with that sort of thing or no? I don't think so. I think that's a little too young still. Do not introduce your kids to Warhammer Can 4. Well, it doesn't necessarily have to be Warhammer. It could be something else that we just paint the war the miniatures. I did look at some of the prices of that stuff and like I don't I don't get it. Like I went on and there was like this this huge demon thing that looked to be like, I don't know, like 15 to 20 inches tall. Like this thing was huge. It was an absolute huge, huge figure. And it was like $170. And I'm like, okay. That's expensive for, for what is essentially a toy, but it's like, all right, comparatively though to the rest of stuff on there, there was like a, 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 just a fancy space marine that must have been just like slightly bigger than a normal space marine, and that was $50. I'm like, how the fuck are they justifying that? Then there was a pack of like four space marines, $75. I'm like, holy shit, why is it so expensive? Some of the, uh, the big kits seem to be price better you know uh, you know comparatively but like is that how they get you it's like oh look just just buy in bulk and it's easier even though that the bulk is a ripoff too i couldn't believe how expensive it was three d print them let me just get my three d printer out of my now i don't have space for a three d printer i'd like to get one though those look interesting it's the disposal that i worry about uh oh we're not a maid anymore I think that thing's in charge here. You can 3D print a 3D printer? Not without a 3D printer, I can't. What if I 2D print the layers? And assemble it into a 3D printer that can just barely work, and then after that, I can print a 3D, a proper 3D printer with with that. Now, I think I think um, I think eight years old is still a little too young for for that sort of thing. I don't know. He's a really creative kid, so I don't know, maybe. I'm almost certain that the answer is yes, but I'm going to ask anyway, just in case. Is is playing Warhammer or Warhammer 40k more complicated than chess? I'm not, like, obviously chess might have a higher, like, skill ceiling or whatever, but it's more complicated than chess, right? The rules and everything? We did it. Yeah! Bomb Chan, no! I haven't tried playing chess with Finn for a while, so if he can understand chess now, maybe maybe he'd be ready for a tabletop game.
Wait, did I just do that? Did I just restore part of the city? With my mind? Who the hell are you? Chan fight. Chan fight. Chan fight. Do you watch, watch chess content creators? No, I was really into chess in high school. I like played competitively and um, I haven't played again since like I was, I don't know, 16 or 17. Like I still know how to play obviously, but it's been a long time. Who put you up to this? Was it was it Ballsy? Well, you're not going to get away with it. Who the fuck is Ballsy? Wait, who the... Now, now, ladies, can't you two get along? If not for your sakes, then how about for mine? Ballsy. <laughs> that was a close shave. <laughs> Minus two. Who's the girl and why is she screwing things up? Are you helping her? You better not be, or I'm going to have to take you down too. Raven, I believe there's been a misunderstanding. Oh, that's so Raven. You're not seeing the big picture here. The woman, Raven, was like me. She had a strange pet and a strange power to go with it. She was too strong, though. I knew it. I knew I didn't have a chance, so I ran. And then I ran some more. Old town freed at last. Tearful reunions fill the streets of Aldenor. Who is the mysterious cat girl, and where did these gravity shifters come from? Okay, are there only two gravity shifters? Because I thought for sure, like, the way that they were talking, that there was, like, multiples. Like, it's it's a thing. But is there only, like, Raven and us? That's it? Trains with Aldenor and its, and its train station back in one piece. The train line is now operational. Cat can now board the train to, to, at the station to access another town in Hexville. I'd rather use a belt. I need to change your pace. Maybe I should check out that train station I brought back. Best girl? Who's best girl? Cat? Raven? How is Raven? Uh, you know what? I agree, actually. Never mind. No, you know what? I, I think I'm going to go with Cat a little bit, but, like, both of them are pretty bad. Is this the new area? No. Is there a new challenge mission, though? With an unlimited gravity gauge and access to special powers, defeat as many Nevi as possible in the time limit. Yeah, we're not going to be able to do that. Pass through every checkpoint and complete the race. Use every gravity trick at your disposal to win. Alright, that seems like it's fun. Let's go do that. And then we can upgrade some of our, our combat abilities, maybe. Where are we going? <sighs> I can't even I can't even get up there. All right, we did it. Oh man, I haven't said thank you in so long. Thank you, Zavalisto, too, for the resub. Sorry about that. Hopefully you're still here, Zavalisto. Thank you also to Mr. Stay Hydrated or Else. Ooh, for the new sub. Welcome to the Gravity Gang. Thank you also to Disco Spider. Welcome to the Gravity Rush Redditors. You get that one for some reason. Thank you very much. And also thank you to E Lizzie Bick123 for the new sub. There were a bunch of new subs that came all at once. Sorry. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Gravity Gang. Is this a requested game or from a random stream? This was a, a voted game. From from the great voting of uh, of 2021. Shit. 
Shit. Shit, 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 shit. I forgot how to, I forgot, I forgot how to, to Dougie. Shit. Oh no! Go back! Oh no, that's not down. It's not going well, chat. It's not going well. There's no way we got gold. Yeah, 11 seconds off. All right, if I had messed up like that thing at the end there, we would have gotten it. Lame. Does this control better than the Witcher? Yeah, it does. Yeah. Witcher horse has a name. It's Vernon Roach. All right, let's just restart, please. We can't. All right, never mind. Okay, it's getting worse. Can I just restart, please? I would like to restart. Please? I would like to restart. You know what? Let's just go out of bounds. It's not letting me. UI blind. I don't see anywhere on the map to 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 fix it. It's a touchpad. Wait, what? Touchpad is dodge. Maybe it's somewhere in here. Cancel mission. There we go. Cancel mission. Okay. We're at four, four hours. Let me go take a break. And then we'll do this again when I come back. Be right back. Go get a drink. Walk around if you've been sitting the whole time, please. Your legs will thank you later.
Oh, I didn't mute the microphone. I muted the game instead. My bad. Let's try this again. Okay, I think I want to get to the to the objective marker thing without landing, so I can keep just like zipping from one to one. I think that's how to do it. Uh, thank you, Serenity Cat, for the new sub. Welcome to the to the Gravity Rush redditors. I think you'll you won't mind that because you have cat in your name. Obviously, you're a big fan. Gotta be more careful, we could have heard your real name was Timothy Pissing. It's true, my last name is Pissing. Alright, maybe I do have to touch the floor. Oh no, I don't. Okay. Timothy Pissinger, how did you know? Good at this. Did I miss one? Oh, for fuck's sake. If you want to play Warhammer with your kids, I have to recommend One Page Rules. The rules are free online and you can play it with any miniatures. It's basically like Warhammer but simplified and without the five different rule books you have to buy just to play. Yeah, something like that would be good, I think, yeah. But I'm less interested in playing the game as I am with like, like, let's make a set, build them, paint them. I just know later on they're probably going to want to play. So it'd be good if there was an option, you know? Come on, how close do I have to be for that? Need our juice back, need our juice back, need our juice back. Just ask Henry Cavill for help? Yeah, let me get him on the phone. I didn't just like, I went the fucking wrong way. I didn't miss it.
four seconds too slow. Four seconds too slow. All right, where am I? Where am I peeling off four seconds? Just better movement. I'm really bad at this, man. I'm gonna try one more time, or one more like good attempt where I actually get to the end. Yeah, that was not worth it. That was not worth it. Man. No, let's restart. Let's restart. Let's restart. I tried to do the um the uh the sliding and it wouldn't activate. I don't know why. What's the easiest way to start sliding? Hold R2 and then hold L2? You could share off four seconds easy if you're on gyro controls. I don't believe you. I've never found gyro controls comfortable in my life chat, so I don't think it's gonna work. They could be better if you're really good at them. Like I'm not I'm not arguing that. Because like I'm shit at this game, so why the fuck would I argue something like that? But like for me, I don't think it's a good idea. So close. Yeah, we did it. All right. That was so close. So close. Oh, man. We have a... We have a lot of gems to spend. All right, should we spend it on? I feel like we should spend it on combat stuff so we can get the other challenges. What do we think? Although gauge, you sh I feel like we're not really hitting the gauge limit all that often right now. So maybe we want, I think we want more combat. Um, gravity kick seems to be the, the big the big money maker, right? Gravity kick does a lot of damage. We use that a lot, I think. Okay, and we don't really use the, the normal kick very much. What's sliding kick? Is that kicking outside out of a dodge? And do we want do we want stasis field to increase? Probably get that too. Let's load it up to three. Sliding kick is kicking out of the R2, L2 slide. I just tried that and it didn't do anything. I 
Like, I'm pressing the kick button right now, it's not doing anything. Are you sure it's not this? It's a contextual move when there's an enemy. Oh, there has to be an enemy nearby. Okay, that's a little confusing. Um, do we want to do some of the challenges right now, or do we want to go to the next area? Let's go to the next area. Let's see. Hey, it's you. Huh? No. Oh, not this again. Look, I told you before, I was trying to save your house, okay? It just slipped in. No, no, not that. You brought back the missing town, didn't you? The girl with the black cat is the talk of the city. Oh, that. Um, yeah. I guess that was me. People are, are already talking about it. Yep, yeah, whatever you did, the train is back in service. Mm, I'll bet that place in Plejeune is open again. Oops, I said that out loud. What? What place, Pops? I want to go too. Slow down, boy. You're a decade too young. Oh, great. That's going to be great. But hey, Plejeune's got the best school in Hexville. Study hard and maybe you'll get in. Sigh. Where are you getting food from? Plejeune's the entertainment district, isn't it? You seem pretty happy that it's back. If it made him forget about his house, all the better. Okay, cool. Are there any more conversations that we missed? There are not. Transportation. Do, do, do. Slowest train NA. Here we go. Thank you, Friction Lawful, for the resub. Thank you, thank you. And thank you to Jeroof or Jeroof for the resub as well. Loves Gravity Rush. That train goes to another part of the city. If I could hop aboard. But there's a gem. I want to get the gem. No, the train! Oh, it was actually like literally hop aboard. Okay. Pin for sliding kick. In Gravity Rush, the, the Gravity Slide has a kicking feature. When Cat approaches an enemy while sliding, she will launch a powerful sliding kick. In this game, the slide kick is automatic and is executed when Cat is in range of the enemy. Oh, okay. I'll try it next time we're in combat. Thank you for the info. Whoa. Couldn't I have just flown over here? Like, I'm, I'm faster than the train. Why are we fucking with the train? I'll just use my anime belts. Okay, where does the train keep going? Does it go back now? Yeah, it goes back now, okay. <laughs> Get fucked! Oh, she's dead! Oh, you can get on the train. Oh, my bad then. I like that they let you ride on top of it. That's fun. I've always run on top of it, to be honest. How many of you have played this game? <laughs> Me? Quite a few of you, okay. Did you hear about the new shifter in town? She brought that missing chunk of Aldnar back. Finally, a little competition for that for that crow woman. If you ask me, she needs to get put in her place. Wait, what? Wow, word travels fast. I'd love to get a gander with my own eyes. They say she's cute, even if she hasn't got much of a body. Oh, is that so? Not much of a body. Hmm. <laughs> well, at least they think I'm cute. Um. So, how do they know about the crow if 
they were gone. Were they in their own dimension? Or was the city just like floating out of reach and now we just pushed it back together? And the crow could go between them all. I don't understand. Entire Vita fanbase is in your chat right now? Nice. Maybe the crow is in that dimension, but the crow was in our dimension too. Can the crow d dimension hop? I guess it doesn't matter. Not worth overthinking. What have you guys been eating? Do you have ice cream? This part of the city was always here. It was the train station that was lost. What? I thought I saw part of like the city like return back, like like mesh back together. I guess we'll see what happens next time. Joe, you can see part of the city is missing over there. Where? Why couldn't they have just flown back? They have flying cars. No, it must have been gone. It must have been like in its own dimension or, or, or cut off in some way. Like they can fly. Hi Joe, first time tuning in. What do you think of this game so hard? First time tuning in ever? Or first time tuning in for the game? Your name is vaguely familiar to me, so maybe not the first time ever. Um, I've enjoyed the game so far. Um, if I was not streaming this, I would continue playing it on my own time, at least for one more session to see where it's going. I like the movement system quite a bit. As of right now, we're probably going to play the second one as well. As of right now. How weep is this game? Pretty weep. Pretty weep, yep. You won't be weeb it. Very weak. You won't be weeb, it's not enemy. Right after Guardian Rush 1, playing 2. I don't know, man. Could we do that to 13 Sentinels? I like to keep pretty, uh, you know, rigorously to the schedule, as you all know. Yeah, right there it took a couple attempts to go into slide. Weird. Okay, where are we going? Challenge mission. Aquaribus Academy's fountain has long served as a place to relax for students between classes, but the water stopped flowing when the field ran out. Get the fountain flowing again to bring relief to the student's stress. All right, let's do that. I like that the game can let me this, like, oh, where do I want to go? All right, let me just fling myself in that direction and just, like, change course and account for it as I fly. I wish there were a couple more moves you could do in the air, maybe. 
but it's already kind of hard to control. It's working. New challenge mission unlocked. All right. Complete the race using only your gravity slides. Slide your way through town to each goal. Oh, great. Okay, here we go. So here I am, doing everything I can, holding on to what I am. Man, when are we going to do a Tony Hawk Pro Skater stream? No! Oh, for fuck! Don't, 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 okay, thank god. Deadly Premonition 2 one. I hear Deadly Premonition 2 has 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 a a helping of yikes, and I'm a little reticent to stream it. We probably should, but I don't know. Maybe it's fine. Why do I have to pay to unlock these, man? We'll probably play it. But I don't know when. I don't know. Why are you asking me? Was I asking you? Extra power, nice. Do, 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 do. Can I get there? I can reach up for sure. Nope, I can't. Nope. Okay, sorry. Alright, don't be a combat one. Don't be a combat one. Don't be a combat one. Okay, that's interesting because you keep your 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 momentum going. Oh, that's really good. Okay. Excuse me, just you know, missing, 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 missing. At this point, I should just let him live. Out of embarrassment.
Garo Joe? I thought it was Emoji Joe. Okay, honestly, I'm kind of I'm digging it a little bit. It's it's not great, but it's definitely better than The Witcher Three. I'm kind of digging the flow a little bit more. says while eating shit. Okay. Better than Pizza Tower. Un unironically, I think like it's similar to Pizza Tower in that like I, I was undervaluing like momentum and like trying to like keep moving. Like like this this has changed a lot for me right now. Like like the, the fact that this is very powerful and it's just like hey, keep moving, keep hitting, keep moving. Like it's 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 pretty good. I think th doing this is just awful. You never want to be doing this. Like if you're doing normal attacks like this, like 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 no. Like honestly, maybe they shouldn't even be in the game. Oh shit! No! Oh, we're gonna die. Alright, we must have got enough, right? Oh, barely, but we did it. Nice. Yeah, it was pretty fun. But it's better than Forspoken Combat? Yeah, it's much better than Forspoken Combat. Forspoken Combat's kind of ass. Whereas this is, um... Mostly not ass. Forspoken did get much better on the weekend again, though. I think it's up to 5.5 out of 10. It had an actually like good boss fight, and I don't mean like it was good for Forspoken. I mean it was good. Loves Forspoken. Forspoken or The Witcher Three combat? Oh man. Combat, I think I take Witcher three, like, but the movement system in Forspoken is pretty good. So I like the movement system compared to Witcher three's boring ass movement. Who's playing Witcher three for the gameplay though, right? You're playing it for Geralt. Would you consider yourself more ass pilled or more of an ass head? <laughs> 
I'm a stan. Alright, so this is the main mission. Let's, uh, what's this one? Is this combat? On the weekend chat, I was talking to the boys, and I said to the boys, like, how would you rate all the games that you have? And they were like, what do you mean? And I was like, well, a common thing is you rate it out of 10. So 10 is the best, and 1 is the worst. So how would how would you like give give your games? And they were a little confused, so I said to them, you know, like like Minecraft is one of your favorite games, right? And like, yeah, so like you would give that a ten out of ten. That's that's like the best game. Like, and they were like, yeah. So I was like, okay, so what about what about the rest of your games? So obviously, I went to, I went to uh, I went to the Mario games, and I was like, how would you rank um, Mario Odyssey? And they both said nine out of ten. I was like, okay, what about Mario Galaxy? Ten out of ten. Super Mario 3D World. Nine out of ten. Super Mario 64, 4 out of 10. Hollow Knight, 10 out of 10. And then, and then, hold on to your fedoras, okay? Hold on to your fedoras, all right? I said to them, boys, what about Hollow Knight 2? What's Hollow Knight Silk Song? And they said to me, both of them, at the same time, we don't know. We can't tell you. And I said, why? And they said, because we haven't played it yet. Imagine the wisdom of children. Imagine, imagine waiting until you play something to rate it out of 10. Imagine, imagine the Nevi are invading. Help evacuate citizens by grabbing them with circle and leading them to the exit picture above. But be careful, Navi attacks will cause you to drop anyone you can. Oh, for fuck's sake. Can I throw them? No, go in! Can I just like hold L1 to like do a, a, a pull up without like fucking like going up in the air? If you hold the stasis button, you can pick up more objects. Really? Presso? My weave! I've been pressing How do you think I've been doing it before? Alright, Lamayo got him. Oh, we're, we're bringing a bench with us. Bench friends. Oh, so now I can carry three things. All right. No, you fucking kid. Well, this sucked. All right, we can do better. Now that we know we can carry more than one guy at a time. How do I get more outfits from my doll?
what's gonna happen 12 days from now when the start of the marbles limit ends and there's only 5% done? Well, I, I extend it. I can extend it forever. And it's not only 5% done, it's way more than 5% done because for Christmas I let I gave the weebs 100 million marble, uh, 100 million points. So we're like we're like way 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 above it. I thought we could carry 3. Ha ha! Shit! Ha ha! All right, that's as good as we're getting, I think. Oh, we did it! Nice. Godel, we got Godel. Godel, Godel, Godel. Sometimes it won't let me pause. It's weird. Okay, so there's a challenge mission over there that... Oh, we did. Okay, and there's another one down there that we did. And then there was this one that we did. And then there's the warp manhole that we that we got. Did we get it? So, what's this, uh... Transportation. Challenge mission. Okay, we did we did those. Alright, so... We're done. We did everything, right? So, let's go, let's go do the main quest. And then we will probably, um... Stop the stream after that. Because, like I said, I, I woke up a little bit, but I'm a little tired today, and I don't want to go six hours today. There was a lot of six-hour streams last week, I think. Maybe tomorrow we'll do six hours. Hey, it's a clothing store. Archibus Academy official uniforms sold here. Ooh, uniforms, huh? I wonder what it'd be like to be a student. Learning new things, making friends, going on first dates. All right, what's gonna happen here? 
Oh. Ron? Careful, you almost killed me. I'm so sorry, are you okay? Oh, um, well. Sure, I'm fine. Uh, yeah, that's me. Oh, shit, I, I, I skipped that line. What a relief. My name's Newt. I'm so happy to run into you. You are? What is this music? Yeah, it's about my friend Echo. She's been acting pretty weird lately. She keeps saying the same thing twice. <laughs> As of yesterday, she's gone missing. Do you think you can help me find her cat or her miss cat? I get it. You wanted me to. You want to meet me because you had a favor to ask. Sai. All right, I can help. Thank you. Oh. This friend, is she your friend or your friend friend? I mean, you know, is she your girlfriend? Huh? Oh, no, nothing like that. We just we just grew up together. Say. You're a lot cuter in person. Are, are all the other shifters as good looking as you? Wow. Unintentional Riz? Cute, cute. Who me? You think I'm... Too many secrets. All right, time to get down to business to defeat the Huns. Check out the uniform. You're really getting into this, aren't you? Oh, should I change back? Don't I blend in better this way? I hope he doesn't think I'm weird now. No, the uniform looks great on you. Anyway, we should split up and ask around to see if anyone has seen Echo. Right, oh my god, he said I look great in uniform. Well, we should be splitting up now. Oh yeah, I guess it would be faster, huh? View map. Talking to citizens. Certain citizens be- Oh yeah, yeah, we know, we know, we know, we know, we know, we know, we know. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know this is a- this could be a heavy question, but don't you think it's problematic that everything is, is called content now? Isn't that such a meaningless word that diminishes everything it describes? Um... No, I don't think so. I don't really have a problem with it. What's your- what's your issue with it? Content is just a- just a way of describing things to do to me. No, I don't really have an issue with it. Maybe I should. Maybe there's a... Like... I mean, you can always say content and then you can just go a level, another level down or up depending on how you want to look at it and describe each each part of it, right? Like, I think it's alright. You're about to ask me... You're about to ask me about Echo, aren't you? Are you a psychic? Well, how'd you know? Are you a fortune teller like Aki? Fortune teller? Nah, I just saw you talking to Newt. You're both looking for Echo, right? Oh, well, have you seen her? If you promise not to tell anyone, you heard it from me. I've got some info you might, you might find useful. Are you aware of the tale of the missing school bus? Oh uh, no, can't say that I am. What does that have to do with Echo? Echo. Well, if there was a school bus, see, taking a group of kids on a trip, but after it left, it never came back. People say it fell over the edge of the world. Even the police gave up looking for it. I can see where this is going. I can see this is going nowhere fast. And this bus has to do with Echo. And this bus has what to do with Echo exactly? Well, there's a rumor floating around school. They say if you walk the grounds alone at night, the bus appears and you can hear voices crying for help. But no one but no one who boards the bus has ever seen from or heard from again. So you think Echo got on this bus? Just a guess, really. Either way, haven't seen her. That was a fantastic waste of time. It's what's going to happen, though. Well, thanks for the, the thrilling story. I guess I should be going now. Would you stream a co-op game like It Takes Two with Lily? Um, Lily doesn't play games. She's starting to play games a little bit more now. Like, she, like she has played a couple games in the past, but Lily, Lily doesn't play games very well. Lily gets motion sick very easily when it comes to games as well. Lily, Lily is not a gamer. What about with Finn? Hmm. I don't feel like I'm comfortable. I don't think I'm comfortable streaming with Finn. Maybe when he's a lot older, I would consider it, but not not right now. Um, do you have a second? I'm looking for this girl. Have you seen her? Hmm, I've never seen you before. How do I know you really go to our school? We get weirdos all the time trying to sneak in here. It's that common? Sheesh. Oh, come on. It's me. You know me. Maybe it's my new look throwing you off? New look, huh? Well, all right. Fake or not, if you can answer some questions, I can I'll tell you about the girl you're looking for. Questions? What kind of questions? Just a little game I came up with to pass the time. If you answer my questions, I'll answer yours. Okay. What is the goddess statue in Plegion holding? Um, Sacred Gem. 
shit. What is the name of the school in Plegian? Uh, Archibus Academy. What part, what body part of the statue is the statue of the school holding up? Right hand. Oh, come on. You didn't know that? Are you even trying? I didn't mean that answer. I meant the other one. I wasn't ready. Just give me another chance, please. All right. All right. Fine. But make sure you're ready next time. I feel like the color of Cat's skin is inconsistent across different uniforms and the comic book and everything. Like, maybe it's a lighting thing? I don't know. Sometimes she she, she looks super light skinned, other times she looks actually quite dark skinned. I don't I don't know. I'm ready this time. You sure about that? Alright, let's do it. Fire away. Uh flag. Shit. Uh, Archivist Academy. Alright, left hand. Okay, so what what is it holding? A fish? Okay, we tried Sacred Gem and we tried Flag. Let's try Fire. Alright, there we go. Archivist Academy and left hand. Did I get them all right? That was fun. How about we do it again? How about we don't? And quit being so excited. Any student could have gotten those answers. Now, you asked me about old Big Bag. Big Bag? No, I was talking about Echo. Maybe it's for the best we're not doing another quiz. I don't know what she's got in there, but she's always running around with the bag filled to the brim, protecting it like it's made of gold or something. It's what got her that nickname. Oh, so Echo's nickname is Big Bag? Okay, where did you last see Big Bag and her uh, Big Bag? Hmm, wasn't around here at least. It's hard not to notice a girl with a bag like that, though. Are we actually talking about a bag, or I think maybe I last saw her heading back to the school? Got it, thanks. <laughs> Gotta be someone down here to talk to. Yeah! Alright, hey. Just an ordinary student, just flying in to talk to you. Hey, you're... Nah, you couldn't be, but you look just like the Gravity Queen. You're her, aren't you? This could turn into a hassle. Time to address the truth a bit, huh? No, you must have me confused. I'm just a schoolgirl looking for my pal Echo, who just flew in next to you. Controlled by gravity. You can't fool me. You're her, aren't you? Give it up, kid. No, I'm afraid not. So have you seen Echo, Echo around here? Echo, Echo, she and I were not exactly on good terms, but you, you really look just like the Gravity Queen. I should know, I'm her biggest fan. Uh, thanks for the help, I mean. You've got to be here. Wait, don't go. Oh, it's down. I'll try the friendly approach. Hey, you, got a sec? Was this necessary? Do I know you? I haven't seen you around before. Oof, better think fast. She's on to me. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm the new transfer student, remember? I can tell we're going to be really great friends. I'm transferring out again tomorrow, but uh-huh. I'm losing her. Uh, by the way, great friend. Have you seen- Great friend! Have you seen Echo around here? Echo, you mean gloomy glasses? Haven't seen her, no, but I wouldn't remember even if I did. Something about her really bugs me. She walks around like she's better than everyone. Because she is. I don't know what Newt sees in her. It's probably just because they grew up together or something. And the way she goes all mental on you if you even come close to that giant bag of hers or those creepy long bangs. Uh, don't get me started. She's a weird one. Wow, this girl sure is negative. Okay, well, thanks for the help. I better get going. Got a pack for the big move. Whatever. By the way, there's a game called Echo about a woman stuck in a mansion with her clones that actively adapt and learn from her behavior. It's pretty shit otherwise, so it might be a Friday game. I think I've seen this game. It looked really interesting, but I heard it was bad, yeah. When I first read it, I thought it was a weave game because I didn't see- I misread clones as clothes. So I thought she's in a mansion trapped with all her clothes that keep adapting to her, and I was like, okay, what, what how the fuck does that work? <laughs> that 
Venom, like Venom, yeah. Don't do it, Merrick. Don't do it. There's one on... There's one OT, the marble? Wait, what? That's one... Oh, that's one of the anime marbles by... Okay, all right. Oh, Echo, Goddess of Plejeon. Wow, he smells like he crawled out of uh, out of the out of the bottle. Okay, I actually read butthole, so like I, I think yeah, we're done soon. Oh, I actually read like wow, he smells like he crawled out of the butthole. Like I saw that and I corrected myself before I got there. Oh, hey, did you just say echo? Sweet, lovely echo with those enticing eyes of slender legs, that adorable smile. She's got me under her belch spell. Her curves, her posture, her slim leg. Hey, I'm looking for echo. Where is she? Ah, the flower of the nightclub, Hick. All the young gents come round to bask in her fragrant glory. Echo, she didn't seem the type from her picture. Why is she working at a nightclub? Who knows? She just appeared one day, like wonderful, wonderful magic. Burp. If you want to see her, she's working there now. Where's this club? Can you show me the show me on this map? If his finger would just stay steady for a second. Got it, thanks. She's working in the club, Morty. Burp. Can't do a fake a fake burp. Um, so could we have gotten him like that right away and that would have been the end of it or no? Excuse me, is Echo here? I heard she was working tonight. I need to talk to her. Who are you and what's your business with her? I'm warning you, I don't want no trouble in my club. So was this was this the club that the guy's dad was talking about? Remember when we like did a whole story and some kid got lost in a mysterious tunnel that led to an, an alternate dimension and the dad was standing in the tunnel and then when we came out, we never saw the kid or the dad ever again and that's just completely unresolved. Someone asked me to look for her and a drunk guy told me she was working here. Hey, could a girl who looks like that be working in a seedy place like this? I need to get her out of here. If not, she might be taken in by some con man who'll steal her every last cent. And ugh, how horrible. Snort. <laughs> um, I'm glad you find the young girl's future getting ruined so funny. Snicker. It's not just, it's not that. It's just, I don't think the echo you're looking for is here. It's a different echo now, huh? Did she leave already? She's not working two nightclubs, is she? I said the echo you're looking for ain't here. The echo that old drunk told you about is me. Ooh. What? Did you even show him that picture? There's more than one Echo in the world, you know? Oh, Echo, Echo. So she doesn't work here? That means you, her, are different Echoes? That's right, and you know, darling, you really shouldn't go track- Oh! Oh, it's, a, it's another girl named Echo. I thought she was like, oh, look, I transformed myself into this. Okay, and you know, darling, you really shouldn't go tr talking trash about things you don't understand. I run a fine establishment here. There's nothing seedy about it. Oh, I didn't mean to offend you. I'm sorry. Not only did I follow the wrong lead, I ended up insulting that poor woman. Lame. This place feels like a palace from Persona. What do you want with me? Sorry to bother you, but have you seen this girl? Why are you asking me? Why me, of all people? Whoa, take it easy, kid. You look like you're gonna break down any second. I didn't see anything, I swear. Ah, uh, what the heck? Hey, get back here. Oh, time to tail him. Catch him. What do you mean, catch him? All right, I caught him. Okay, game, I don't think you, like, catch does not mean what you think it means. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey Yoshi, what's up? You know something, don't you? If you wouldn't, you wouldn't run if you didn't. Whoa! I don't know anything. I didn't look inside the bag. Honest, calm down and start making sense. I'm just asking about Echo. Huh? She didn't send you? The bag was full of severed heads. No, I'm trying to find her. So you looked in the bag? You should respect the girl's privacy. I know I should, but the bag, it moves. It's so I sort of had to look inside. She talks to it sometimes, you know? All right, it's a bit odd. What was in the bag? Does she have a, like an animal too? Is she a shifter? I'm not sure. I took a peek when no one was around and before I knew it, I was lying face down on the ground. I must have gone into shock or something. What could be scary enough to knock someone out? Hmm. Where were you at? Oh, where, were you aware that y Echo has been missing since yesterday? She has? I thought I saw her walking around the school plaza. She had the, the bag with her too. But when I saw her with it, I ran. The school plaza, huh? All right, thanks for the help. The whole bag peeking thing will be our secret. Th -th thanks. Let's see, based on the info we've gathered thus far, it sounds like we better check around the school for Echo. Meow. Oh yeah, we have a cat. Man. The cat is just a nothing, huh? When is it gonna turn into a cute anime boy? Oh shit! Newt, you're here too. Cat, I asked around and everyone seems to think Echo's somewhere around the school. That's the impression I got too. Hmm, what now? Maybe we should split up again and look for her. I know, let's look from atop one of the taller buildings. We're more likely to spot something from way up there. Come on, I'll take you with me. What, you're gonna fly me up there? Hell yeah, here we go. Not just you, but these random people next to us too. Here we go! Woo! Oh wait, what? No, we're not. We're going, we're going to the statue? Newt, what did you do? Whoa, that was incredible. What a rush. Look at that smile on his face. Oh, you know, all in a day's work. He <laughs> So do you see anything from up here? Hmm, no, no sign of echo. Oh, all right. Let's go a little higher then. Can we get much higher? How is that just like the most appropriate song at all the time Check out that view. That's something you don't see every day. You're amazing, cat. How do you do it? I don't know. I just can. He thinks I'm amazing. To be honest, I don't know how I got this ability. Just lucky, I guess. I think Dusty here. Hey, over there, it's Echo? Oh, no. It's just May. She's looking for Echo, too. We should check in with her. Right. May, did you find Echo? We've looked everywhere. Sorry, Newt. Hey, hey, I tried everywhere, but no luck. Who's the girl with you? Oh, her? She's that famous gravity queen. She's been helping us look for Echo. She even took me up flying. It was incredible. Blush, hee <laughs> hee. Oh, it was my plep. Nice one, Newt. Now you've gone and got another girl falling all over you. Poor Echo. May? Sorry, I, I think I'm just a little tired. My face is tired. Can you go and check the student center? Someone said they saw Echo there. Student center? You mean that old abandoned building? All right, I'll check it out. You should go home and get some rest to here. What's with May? Did I say something wrong? Oh, um, yeah, leave it to us. We'll find her. All right, why are we going like this? Oh, maybe it was just normal ass gravity, huh? It's okay, as long as we have each other, I'll be happy. It's not that big of a bag. I was I was like expecting her to have like a fucking Santa Claus sack. Anyone else like expecting like a like like a bag almost as big as her? Like that's not a big bag, it's a normal ass bag. And new Echo. 
Everyone has a bag at school. Where have you been? Why'd you run off like that? You're just like all the others. Leave me alone. Echo, why are you acting like this? Are you hiding something? No, stay back. It's a Nevi. Uh, I should probably leave you two al Oh no, she's gonna turn into evil Echo. I am thou, thou art I. Echo, get back. Alright, this is anime, so I'm really nervous right now. Oh, deadly premonition. Uh-oh, she's dead? She's fucking dead? I hate you, all of you. I wish everyone would disappear. No. That's not me. Echo, what's gotten into you? Cat, you gotta help her. Help her, she's dead. Newt. The longer it takes to save Echo, the more of her... Of, uh, the more of her the nephew will eat away if the infest infestation level reaches 100 should be lost forever forever Oh man, I keep missing like hell. Alright, let's get some. Big inspiration from the Mario games in this, huh? Especially Galaxy, obviously. Did we lose? Phase two? Echo. Echo. Why? Why does everyone want to hurt me? What are, you, what are you talking about? Nobody wants to hurt you. Liar, you laughed at me. What? No, I didn't laugh at you. I mean, I laughed, but that was because I liked you. New? I just couldn't say in front of everyone. Echo, I... Rah! Defeat the Nevi. healing oh I'm dead oh man never mind healing I'm just dead I'm deet
flawless victory. I nearly killed her. Oh, whoops. Man, why do you just do this from the start? I'm sorry, you were just trying to protect me. What? Yeah. Uh-huh. Hey, you're not alone. You still got me. Do you remember this? You got it back when we were kids, and you saved me from falling. What are we doing? I slipped off the big tree out back, but you caught me. Back then, I was a little one. You were always looking out for me. I miss just hanging out with you, not caring what, peop what other people thought about us. I'm sorry. I guess I still have a lot of growing up to do. I just didn't want anyone to know how I felt. But now it's my turn to look out for you. Newt! Sosuke Bosuke, let's go. The Nevi was only was only trying to protect the girl, but I destroyed it. They, they were more than monsters. I know that now. Maybe I even felt it then. Something about the whole episode nagged at me as I walked away. Episode? Okay, what, why, why, why are you doing this? Why, why, why? What, what, what are we doing right now? Okay, all right, cool. She just did that all on her own. Why do you keep changing back to your default costume? Gotta be a maid. Phew, excuse me. All right, there we go. All done. Okay. Uh, are we gonna finish the game tomorrow, chat? Like, did we did we make good progress today? I felt like I fucked around a lot, and I still feel like we got a, a decent amount through the game. Maybe it's gonna be uh, three streams, not two. And then on Friday, we'll play Pizza Tower. Gotta get through Pizza Tower, right? Joe, it's a small handheld game, actually comfortable amount of content. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it's stuffed with a bunch that much bullshit around the uh, around the map. Sorry. I like it so far. Uh, I'm enjoying it. I think it's pretty fun. I like I like the movement system a bit. I don't think I've ever played a game that had a movement system like this, where you can like fling yourself through the sky and then land on the different um, types of uh, like any surface and then cling to it. Um, I don't know if I would prefer this to like um let's say like if i if i went on this wall right now right i don't know if i would prefer this like how it is right now is if if i jump i will fall cuz gravity was on that wall right i don't know if i would would have preferred it if um instead if i cl if i cling to a surface right then as long as i walk forward gravity always matches whatever's below me i don't know if that would have been better you know, maybe there should be a button that you hold down and you can activate that mode, right? But, I don't know. Like Mario Galaxy? Yeah, I kind of like Mario Galaxy. It does when you slide, does it really? And then when I let go, do I fall? Seems like it's within limits. Okay, so that changes uh, what the new gravity floor is. Okay, I like that. Yeah, thank you for pointing that out. I don't think I would have figured that out on my own for hours and hours and hours. That's pretty good. Yeah, I like it. Uh, the combat's kind of ass, but 
now that I'm trying to chain more acrobatic moves together, um, I think it's a bit better. The bosses are really, really bad, but um, like chaining this while you're going through enemies, like bum, 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 and then like up in the air, you know, do a kick. Um, it's not bad. I wish there was a little bit more to it, obviously, but it's fine. There's a mod for Witcher where he gravity slides around. I think I've seen that, yeah. It looks like he's skateboarding through uh, through Novograd. I would say so far the weakest part of the game, apart from the story, obviously because it's a weeb game, is the um, is the visuals. I don't think the visuals are all that great, but like they're not terrible, like they're serviceable. But um, I wish that the game looked better. But I understand it's it's an upscaled like PS Vita game, so like I'm I'm willing to tolerate it but the game doesn't look that great to me especially the characters the characters look kind of like yeah even the main character is like what's going on here What's your opinion on the music? Music's decent. Typical like uh uh JRPG fair even though it's not a JRPG. Gravity Rush 2 for sure. Yeah, probably. I think we're, we'll, we'll play the second one, yeah. Gravity Rush 2 after this one or not? Haven't decided yet. Anything to delay 13 Sentinels. We could do Gravity Rush 2 into Resident Evil 4 or Resident Evil 4 into Gravity Rush 2 and make 13 Sentinels pay for it. Okay, are there any new quests or anything around here? Oh, there's some new challenge missions and stuff. Okay, all right. All right, so let me go save it again. Um, how do I do that? I want to go to... Our house. Underneath the street. Do people want to see 13 Sentinels? Oh yeah, it's like number three, I think, on the most anticipated games to stream. Uh, actually, you know what? Of of the voted games, it's definitely up there. Overall, of all the games to stream, I think it's probably it's probably not even in the top five. But um, what's number one of the games on the list? Either Th Fire Emblem Three Houses or AI Nirvana Institute. I would say that's probably number one from my read on it. Number one period is either Persona Five Royal or Persona Three. How do you vote? The voting happened a long time ago. The voting's done. Powering up Cat makes it easier to get through some tougher areas. For example, leveling up Gauge usage will allow her to shift gravity for longer periods. Of yeah, I know. I know. I know. You don't have to tell me. I know. I know. How do we vote again? When the voting game comes back. If it ever comes back. Okay, we flew around for a bit and then we, uh. We saved it again. Alright, five hours and 20 minutes. A little bit longer than I wanted to go, but that's fine. Alright, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you all tomorrow for more Gravity Rush. Uh, we'll probably finish it, like people said, on Thursday. And then Friday we'll play with some more Pizza Tower and then Forspoken on um, on Saturday. Or maybe if we are going to play Gravity Rush 2, maybe we'll just go into Gravity Rush 2 on, on Friday. Because that's a continuation of Gravity Rush and then we don't have to play fucking Pizza Tower. I'd like that. I don't mind playing the sequel of a game right away um, on a Friday. Because that's uh, that's just more of the game that we're currently playing. So I think that would be that would be fine. But yeah, I enjoyed the game. It's pretty fun. I'm, I'm looking forward to playing more some more tomorrow. Have a good rest of your day. I'm gonna go see if Lily wants to order some pizza.